but that's out. General Hospital is on. I gotta watch it, girl. You know, I gave up stories a long time ago. There she is. Hey, hey, I don't know how long you've been sitting back there. I'm just over here running my mouth reading. I just so happened to see a little thing pop up here. Did you just come up? I just came up. Okay, okay. it popped up at the top. Yeah. Like, okay. How you Everybody doing? Asking about you, like where's Felicia? Felicia, where's Felicia? Look, Felicia just got <laughs> home. Let her rest. Felicia, I was asleep. I had set my alarm, and then I was hitting the the um snooze button. I was like, "Girl, you gotta get up. You can't just keep hitting the snooze button." Hey, y'all. <laughs> Two hundred and twenty-eight eclipses from nineteen hundred to two thousand. That's a lot, Mike. Right. right. So this ain't, this ain't, there's so many eclipses. Why are they tripping about this one? It's been a bunch of eclipses. The last the last big one, excuse me, people. Let me do this. I'm in Texas too. Uh, well, nice to meet you, Cliff. Where you at in Texas, Cliff? Is that better? Hey, hey Janet. Hey girl. Hey. Hey, Sunday. In Texas, you coming to the kickback J3? Hey J3GS, I hope he come. I just saw them. Girl, let me tell y'all, guess what? Yeah. I want tickets to go to the, to the Texas thing, the Texas kickback. I get in free. Woo! Nice. That's right. Matter of fact, unbiased had did a giveaway for the tickets at the um to go to the kickback. And I was on there. I was trying to play the game, and things happened, and so I couldn't play the game, right? So, uh, Crafty Leo won, and she passed the tickets on to me. Nice. That was beautiful. That was so beautiful. I tell you, this community is uh -oh. awesome. You know, I don't see too many selfish people in the community. I really don't. Yeah, this is a really good community. I love my people. Uh -huh. Well, yeah. it's supposed to be 80 degrees here in Texas, too, Jessica. Now, hey, the crochet queen, how you doing? Girl, we got a house full of folks up in here. Yeah, we do. Nice. The best I can hope for here is Hamilton, Texas is a high cloud ceiling. Oh. So, Hamilton, Texas. I don't know where. I'm going to have to look that up. I don't know where I don't that's know at. Hamilton, Texas, but I don't, okay, I don't know a lot of places. So. You live in Amarillo? Amarillo by morning. MDL, what's your name? And I won't forget. Just tell me your name. We don't get a lot of clouds, but a lot of wind and dirt. Hey, Mike. <laughs> we get snow, man. I try my best not to see no snow. We want. Hey, Jessica. Hey, J three. Here for the Eclipse, but who wants to go to Amarillo? Hey, almost homesteaded hey, with Janet. Hey, almost homesteaded with Janet. Oh. Somebody hollering, China! Hey, China. <laughs> Somebody hey, China. happy to see you, China. Hey, Sunday, you? Back in heart. hey y Don, Yon Dog. I'm still upside of the ground. Don, 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 Don. Well, just relax, you know? Take it easy. Hey, hey Sunday, friends. yo, yo, family. How you doing, Sunday? Are you tired? <laughs> I know he you is. Tired? I know he is. Tired. Do y'all do a lot of dancing? No. I ain't see a whole lot of videos. That's what I didn't see. But no, not a lot of dancing. I didn't do a lot of dancing. No, nah, I can't get back to sleep. Uh-oh. Zach, you just said you was going to bed. But Felicia come up here and wham on. I can't go to sleep. 
Look, don't mess with Zach. That's my boy. <laughs> hey, Jessica. Hope you had fun in Savannah. Did yep. I had a lot of fun in Savannah? Miss, Miss Felicia. Yes, hey, y'all. Hi, Lydia. China, my girl. Hey, Zach. Zach, Zach, Zach. Uh oh, did I miss Jane some? Doe. Jane Doe. I'm walking, walking, you going through looking at people. Jessica. Heart of Orion. Jewelry. Heart of Orion. Julia. To farms. Hey, Jane Doe. How you doing? Darth X. Experience with Sassy. What's up, brother Mike? Jane Doe. Somebody just told me I won on uh Crochet Queen. On on uh Grow Big. Did you do you know anything about that? Oh crap. I meant I wasn't on there today. I forgot. I was out and about in the streets. Hey, Queen's Craft by Bridget, awesome. Deborah Garrett. No, Chris, sorry. Chris, this time. Heart of they Orion. He's not going to be able to make it this time. Heart of Orion jewelry. That's new to me. No, hey, no, Heart no, of no. Orion. Girl, I'm so happy. I can't wait to go get some crawfish. I'm Look, I'm going to have, I'm going to be video showing y'all all that crawfish. That they're gonna mm -hmm. have. I hope it's good. I hope it's I'm not ready spicy. for the crawfish. I hope it's not spicy. I don't know. Um, I don't know if I'm be by myself or not. I might be by myself, but I'm coming. <laughs> no MDL crochet Hamilton is what's the Waco about halfway between Dallas and Austin? Middle of oh. okay. That's why I don't know where Hamilton is. Okay, because I Waco and Dallas. No. Ryan, Everybody. Hey, here. Duval. Don't forget to pop over to Felicia House and Diddy click that girl. like button. Bonnie, I, girl, would you tell them? Don't forget Felicia. Go on over there. Hey, Miss Georgia Peach I'm tired, Duval. I'm tired. I know you're tired. You did it. Yes, all in one day. My Michael. Okay, who's Michael? Is that MDL? Mm. Is his name Michael? I don't know. MDL. We, we trying to hire us, huh? Okay. I have gone almost all the way back. Hi, I'm trying Michael. to catch everybody. Don't work spell it either. Darn it. Or my, if I had my glasses did, did on. Did you my... say hi to your sister? Nope. Please smash the like button. Hey, Deborah. I'm on. I haven't put my glasses on. Mara, no, you probably um probably gone. Ma hey Mara, if you're still here. Yeah, I went so Bonnie. Hey Bonnie, if I didn't say no, Bonnie. the hell you not Bonnie. Whoa, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, what happened? What yes. happened? What we got going on? Hey Mara is not grandma. There ain't nothing going on. <laughs> she said. Oh, hell no, you not, Bonnie. What Bonnie trying to do? Look, I, look, I'm trying to find That's what I'm trying to find out. Hey, yeah. Hudson, growing with Hudson. Thanks for coming in, y'all. Hey, growing with Hudson. Came home and went straight to work in the garden. Mm. Uh-oh. Hey, I want to show my stuff, but I got to wait till Tuesday because Miss Peach and I got to tell me what to do with them seeds that I dropped on her live. Oh, okay. They are overgrown. Thank y'all for coming in on my side and giving me a thumbs up. I appreciate y'all. LOL, LOL. Yes, MDL is Michael. Okay, okay, great, great, great. Hey, God's desire for me. Am I that far behind? Um, I've never been down here 13 years now. I'm still not tired much. I still not tried mud, but girl, let me tell you where I come from. We use them things for bait, right? Girl, I that's get good. Here. That's good eating. So, you can use actually, when I was in the service, a girl came that was she had some, 
And, you know, I couldn't do it. But now that I'm here in Texas, they do it a lot. So I was like, okay, I try it first. You know, when you first try, they have to, you know, do open it up for you. Look, I have my moments. I have Ooh, times where nice. I can eat it. I have times where I can't eat it. I have times where I don't even want it. But lately, <laughs> I've been wanting it. And but you gotta, Mona, you won the herbal handbook. What? Oh, uh-huh. that look, girl, need a herbal. I, I got some herbal handbooks. So, well, you know. But you know, you can always do good in the book. You know, but if if I already have the book, I can do a giveaway. That's right. Oh, I'm supposed to do a giveaway tonight, huh? You can. I've been down here. Oh, wait a minute. I'm stuck. I don't got it. Will be good. It will be good, no doubt. Oh, yeah. Between okay, no doubt. Okay, look, we are gonna see. I'm gonna be the taste tester. <laughs> so I'll be yeah. taste tester. Yeah, I'm gonna be the taste tester. I'm gonna be the one. I'm gonna tell you the truth. Jane Doe, the book herbal handbook. Yeah, she say I won. Oh yeah, I'm just now getting down here to growing with her. So, hey, G Hood, what's <laughs> up? I saw G Hood. Santi jealous when I saw y'all together. I know. I got jealous because I was like, well, it ain't nobody fault but mine because I didn't go. But Don't be jealous. Don't be jealous. It's it's okay. Came home and went. Everybody can't go dinner. all the time. I can't go all the time. How are you, Niffy? We got a, a new person here. Have you ever heard of Niffy? Nope. Niffy say... They knew this is the first time they subbed. They subbed over here. Hey, they Niffy. came over from Myra's channel. Thank you for coming over. I'm still here, Niffy. You finished on um, winding up your yarn, Myra? Okay, left out. My name is Cliff. A few call me. Thank you, MDL Crochet. Cliff. Um, you have a good one. Because hey, Melissa P. accidentally misspelled. Hey, YouTube, yeah. please. Good no, to see you, man. In Dermot. <laughs> okay, okay. Hey, Cliff. Nipsey, nice to meet you too. I, I don't. I'm gonna call you Cliff because so, uh, I don't know uh, how to pronounce that one. Pronounce what? Cliff what name. They he say they tease him because Jessica misspelled it one day, and so they call him C. Kiff. Oh. Uh, Instead of Cliff. Instead of Cliff. Okay. Uh -huh. Yes, MDL is Michael, my boo. Oh, that's your boo? Girl, okay. That's your boo? Who boo? China boo. Michael okay. is China boo. Well. Okay. I heard that. China are good friends. We just messing around, but... She tried to say Michael's hers. She got. She's got. Fear. A uh oh, oh, oh y'all doing it like that? I mean, you know, <laughs> I'm, it's not after twelve o'clock. I'm gonna be nice. I ain't oh, gonna start it ain't. It ain't starting no this with y'all. It not ain't Saturday. I'm <laughs> doing good. I hope it. Say it ain't Saturday. No, it ain't Saturday. Oh, she done planted her seed. She got it to expo. Dang, you good girl. I ain't I ain't playing my I got too many seeds. She did what she got she planted all her seeds. She lost that she planted her seeds that she got at the expo. When yeah. I was left, they was contemplating a, a little field trip over to the Home Depot. I was what? like Y'all is yeah, they do that every year too. I know no, I can't because I got to fly back. Right, I'm right. Not. I can't say I won't drive to Georgia because I did. You did, yeah, and it was hard. So it's I don't a long way. Do it again, 
Girl, you should have hooked up with um. Well, you probably y'all probably wouldn't have crossed paths, but so you should have hooked up with Butler because they drove from Missouri. Somebody else drove from Missouri too. Oh, I um, would have hooked up with um Bias. She would have rolled with me, like some, she did the last time. I'm trying to remember who else. That, that girl would drive. Else. Okay, somebody Look. else came from Missouri too. She had her foot so deep up in that pedal. I was like, Lord, have mercy. Let us get where we got to go. <laughs> Let me hold it on. Let, let me stop. Let me stop. Wow. She, say she ain't going to never go nowhere with me again. Let me shut up. You done talked about her driving. I wouldn't go nowhere with you neither. Talk about somebody driving. I My wasn't talking about her. I ain't talked about her. It's a giveaway item that Mona won. Oh. Right back home. Was C right. Yeah. Right. Okay. Heart of Orion. That's the restaurant where I come from. There. There's What's that? cornbread and chicken. Okay. I don't remember. Mud bugs. If we are talking about crayfish, I'm in. Yeah, we're talking about crawfish. Crawfish. <laughs> crawfish, crayfish, mud bugs. Um, they call something else too. Uh, uh, that's what I was yeah. trying to think. Um, yep. I'm trying to think what we used to call them. Was it? Hey, Don. Thanks for coming on my side. <laughs> yeah, they they having some here at the Crawfish Festival. They have called a, a crawfish kickback. Yeah, hey, I you say cars. my sister was in the chat? Yep, she was here in the chat. Hey, sissy, wherever you are, I don't see it. She <laughs> was up here in the beginning. You probably can't even see it. Oh, she she probably still listening. Hey, buy you sugar. 30, 30, 30, 30. <laughs> Wake up, 30. Wake up. Hey, hey. Ah, how you yeah, doing? I need to head out and get a few hours of sleep. Left the thumbs and both pages and so. Okay, Michael. Really, thank I appreciate you. you from coming through. And thanks. You know, have some good sleep, sweet dreams. Hey, Miss Indiana Jackson. You too, police. So, if I Humphrey. So, <laughs> Gary, <laughs> oh, there's cornbread where I come from. A lot of front porch sit. Yep, just waiting to clock out. Okay, okay, Mona, what's going Not on? Hard. Your seedlings, girl, they tall, long, and coming out the pot. I left for the weekend. I came back. It's after 12 here. Now. All right, day three. I'm like, I'm like <laughs> I just dropped these things Tuesday. The best guy. But I need to be doing something. It was really good action. seeing you. J3 going to be. He tapping out. <laughs> sub, 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 sub. Sub. Sub, Gary. You missed the cookies. Girl, I saw them cookies. I was like, you know, she know I'm a cookie monster. <laughs> you know I'm a cookie monster. Because, you know, yeah. you made me a cake last year for my birthday. And that cake so was good. I know them cookies looked good. I was trying to lick the dog. You got four plants and a pepper plant. Okay. Let me stop. <laughs> <laughs> Four plants and a pepper plant. Yeah, um, growing Hudson got that orange quad. Uh-uh, she got an orange quad? An orange quad. I, I looked at it and I said, I'm not buying no plant. I'm, I should have bought it. I would have been upset because I wouldn't have been buy nothing. She needed it. She needed it. <laughs> um, yeah, the, um, they had some citrus growers there this year who had some plants. Great nifty plants. That was nice. Next Sunday and Monday. We'd be on. Oh, Monday. almost almost homesteaded with Janet. Yeah, Butler came. It was good to see him again. I saw them last year at Paddles from the Past. And I got to come from Butler. So y'all, 
Be on the lookout. Because mm -hmm. I'm going to show you when I get it. Yarn during the live and then another one after the live. Okay. Okay. So you did get it wind up. Felicia's link so I can sub and thumbs up. Oh. Who was looking for my link? Oh. Uh, Hurt. Oh, Cliff. Hey Queens. Um, it should be in the chat. It should come Not up in the chat. Cliff is C Kiff. <laughs> Cliff is Orion's jewelry, right? Right. Okay. Hey my Renaissance grandma. You know what? I need to do that. Leadfoot farmer. Uh, they talking about unbiased leadfoot farmer. <laughs> oh, please don't call her that. Lord have mercy. I'm that sorry. Tie my hair to the white meat. Buy you sugar. Say I got my package. Hey, Indiana Jackson. Hey, hey, I showed right past you too. I'm glad somebody said something because I showed real scroll right past you. Look, oh. how you doing? I saw you there. Yep. Yep. Saw you. Oh my goodness. We was in cahoots getting seeds. <laughs> you waiting to clock out. You gonna go live tonight? Uh crawfish yeah. boil back in the day. Yeah, I right. love craw good crawfish boil. My Michael. Oh, oh you're YouTube. Police belt loot. <laughs> it's about here okay, yeah. J3, get you some rest, man. Also, Gary, um, you behind, Mona. You got to catch up. <laughs> trying. I got Ooh. four plants and a pepper plant. Wow. Hey, Birdie. I can't have road with Butler. I'm not that far from Missouri. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, it was maybe next time. Georgia, Georgia. Hey, Georgia. Shantarman. Hey, Shantarman. Me pulling good grief. Have blossoms in my apple tree for the first time in three years. Nice. And put it in the pot. Awesome. Hey, Jones. Fine. Come wake up. Both of my apple trees is not doing anything, but I'm not. I'm gonna keep on watering. Keep on. Yeah. Just. Let them go. Let them do what they do. Georgia Peach Nut Garden, their tomatoes. Okay. Hey, my Renaissance grandma, did I speak? If I didn't, I'm speaking again. If I did already. You was at the beginning. You probably did. I probably did. Always a pleasure to hey, see yeah. you. About Luke 29, 29, 29. Yep, Luke 29, Homestead. Hey, Gary. Honey. At crawfish bull. Thanks, Bonnie, for coming over to my channel. Girl, it's time. It's time. It's crawfish. There's a lot of people up in this chat. Uh, look, I'm having a hard. Hey, Shintyrement, how you doing? It's yeah, I'm having a hard time keeping up. <laughs> hey, Jones, true. That's, That's why up. I'm over here going through each one. <laughs> look, you saying catch up? I'm, look. You know how I like to, you know, speak to everybody, okay. talk to everybody. Thanks, unbiased, for the link. Let's kick in to the medicine, kick in, and finally feeling better. Thanks for good. I'm so glad you feeling better. I'm supposed to be saying I'm in the bushes. Okay, you the lady in the bushes. Okay, we got you. You gonna be there again this fall? Well, I'll be there. I need to my melons. These are melons. Remember, I dropped all those melons on your live. Okay. And they took Sweet. Me out of the container. I'm going to go get them and show you. But I wanted to wait so you could tell me what to do. That'd be a good class. Good job. Good job. This is. This is the link for the crawfish kickback. Thank you, um, Ryan. Thank you, unbiased, because uh, you know, yeah, because hey, I was asking last week. I'm gonna be there, so if y'all want to meet the special, sifting some salt, come on down. 
so I can beat you down in some dominoes. Oh, Lord. Here we go again. Thank you, Mara. I ain't going to uh, Appreciate you. <laughs> Let me stop. I was supposed to say I'm in the bushes. It's okay. You're all right. I know you're not feeling well. You did say hello. Belt Loop 29 dropped yeah, his yeah. um his link. Y'all check him out. At least. Go on, Hudson. Miss, Mrs. In, Mr. Mrs. in Indiana Jackson's son was, he was so sweet. Oh. Yes. He was a very he nice young man. Uh -huh. Thank you, Myra. Get some rest because I know you got to go to work in the morning. Y'all help her brother out with the sub if you're not already. Okay. Why you sugar said I was I was um she said I was it was scissor hands today and cut branches off my satsuma tree. They look dead. Okay. I was looking at my little my little citrus plants out in containers today, and I was like, this one needs to be up planted. This one is doing okay. I fertilized all of them about a month and a half ago, and they're looking much better. They look dead. Were they dead, though? The ones you clipped off, were they dead when you looked at it? Did you see any green by you, sugar, since you was, you know, getting rid of stuff? Thanks, Thank Jessica. I appreciate you coming over here. I got to go in the bushes during my dishes, but I'm here. Okay, Bonnie, go and get them dishes done, because I... They're done. Exactly. Look, <laughs> I get my kitchen clean when I'm on some... Look, baby. Yep. Yep. That's hey. why I don't be speaking to folks all the time, because I'm doing stuff. I can't just sit here and watch the chat. Y'all check I'm out um, Go On With Hudson's yeah, channel. She dropped her link. Okay. Yeah, if Hudson dropped her link. Check her out. Oh, it's a I yellow. Got a lot going on over there. A yellow meat, a orange meat, a crimson, uh, uh crimson, uh, uh, but Charleston you, gray, okay, and a um, uh, a Korean melon, and they all coming. They all overgrown. Okay. They, they, um, I need to repot them like right now. If I showed y'all, y'all be like, girl. Stand by. I had a blast last night. Okay. Okay. Right now. <laughs> I can hear her right now. I can hear right now. Duval says she is seventy away from a thousand. Duval, oh. drop your you on you. I'm on the side. Drop your link. Type in hashtag sift s i f t. Right. Drop your link. Hashtag sift. You, just you have apple. Yeah, I got two. I have a a granny apple. And I have a, a a golden delicious. Yeah, I have a Anna apple and a I hope my black apple. Mm -hmm. And both of those, yes. both of uh -oh. mine, the the Anna has has budded out mm -hmm. and um mm -hmm. is beginning to leaf out. I, and I, the Arkansas okay. black is, green, the, yeah. is beginning to bud out. Yeah, a lime quad. A lime quad. I ain't never heard of it. <clears throat> It's just a cross between a kumquat and a lime. Where she get it? Who who said they got Damn a lime quat? Man, raked up too. They did. I bet they did. They get, man. You got an orange quat. You ain't getting no lime quat. Hudson, you got an orange quat. Unless you went someplace else and got a lime quat. <laughs> because if you ain't had a lime quat, hey, hey, I would have <laughs> a prickly pear cactus. This is every at Sunday the night. orange. Oh, at the orange pot store. I should have went over there to the box store. Bamman and friend rocked up too. Did they? Yeah. I have a red delicious. Hey, Hudson, you got a red delicious um apple tree. Nice. Leave them apple trees alone. They go. They just young. Yeah. Okay, young. Yeah, leave them alone. My apple trees are doing fine. Mine are young. I just planted them last year. I just got them last year. Um, they're young, so they're budding out this year. They're looking pretty good, though. I need to walk out there. I didn't walk out there when I got I home today. I would be an owner of a Granny Apple, uh, Granny Smith apple tree and Red Delicious. What? 
Okay, let me just tell y'all where I get my. Let me get to the bottom. Oh, I'm at the bottom. Let me I done made it. Tell y'all where I get my trees from. I got my trees from Bottoms Nursery online. Home, but I have Bottoms is out okay. of Drive Safe, Georgia. Gary. Oh. Drive Safe. All right, Drive Safe, um, Gary, on your way home. We are forty miles away from home. It's been a long day. I bet it is. You yeah. still driving? Indiana Jackson. Wow. That means you almost home if you 40 miles. You almost home. You almost home. Hang in there. Be safe on the road, y'all. Um, I get my I got my apple trees from Bottoms Nursery. You can go online. They have a website. They're out of South Georgia. Um, and um they ship them during your planting season. So if you order them and it's not the season to plant them, they're not going to ship them until it's time for you to plant them. And I have everything that I bought out of Bottoms Nursery and I bought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I bought seven things out of Bottoms Nursery. Everything that I bought is still is still doing well. Look at this. Oh, look at you, girl. I planted some seeds before. I dropped some seeds before I left. They haven't come up yet, but I'm waiting. Well, I just dropped these Tuesday. Yeah, mine haven't come up yet, but they're not. Mine are out in the garage, and it's a little bit cool at the night. I have an Anna and a Dorset, said Duval said. Okay. Sifting some soil more. You are living my dream. I would love to be an owner of a Granny Smith apple tree and a red delicious apple tree. You can't, you too can be an owner of an apple tree. <laughs> okay. Hey, Glamour. The Glamour Planner. Hey, how you doing? Jane, don't say nice. I'm waiting for what Miss Peachnut got to say. And Indiana Jackson said we're 40 miles away from home. I'm catching up, y'all. Look like those little babies blooming. Yeah, they coming up. They they don't have their true leaves on there yet. Well, I don't I remember, remember how much those trees were. They were bare root trees. Um, and I don't remember how much the trees were, but they do have good prices at Bottoms Nursery. Now I have ordered from the there's another nursery online that's in um central georgia okay okay called willis orchards i have ordered from there too that's where i got my pear tree and two of my plum trees and they're doing fine too it's called willis orchards let me write this in here um and uh, and i got some new containers and i dropped some other uh seeds I did a uh I think it's a called sugar what? pie pumpkin and a, a what now a sugar pie pumpkin and okay. and I got I got them seeds from seeds now I got a uh a squash pink banana I dropped that and it's I think it's coming up already I just dropped that the other day too. Okay. I bought my peach tree from Tractor Supply. Duval said, uh, I mean, Duval. Duval said she got her apple trees from um, I think I Tractor sold Supply. I got my peach tree and my medley pear from Tractor Supply, and they're doing good. Um, from Willis Orchards, I bought my kefir pear. Wait a minute. Medley plum from Tractor Supply. From Willis Orchards, I bought my kefir pear and my Celeste fig and my Chickasaw plum. My mom ordered plants from online. She said they only ship them when it's safe. Exactly. They ship them when it's time to plant in your grow zone. They will ask you what your um your, for your zip code. And when it's time to plant those bare root trees is when they'll ship them because they ship them dormant and you need to plant them during dormant season when um in your grow zone 
Um, and generally, once you plant them in the ground, you water them in good, they start growing right away. They start really putting their roots down right away. Did you guys see my new tree? I added a peach tree from Tractor Supply, Clamor Planner. I need to go back and look and see. Six bows. Six bows is back. Hey, Y'all, sugar pie, pumpkin, squash, pink banana. What? Do you know Willy Wonka or something? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I don't know Willy Wonka, but this um squash, I the seed is coming up, the sugar pie, pumpkin hasn't come up, and I did another squash. I did drop that, and I think it's coming up. Is but it's just like a little. It's I'm getting ready to put it up under the light. Because right now I got it on a heating pad. And that heat, yeah. I'm on the melon seeds come up long, come out long. Just keep a light over them. It's a light on top of them until you get them leaves. Okay. Okay. I, um. So do I keep the light on at 24 hours or do I turn it off during the daytime and turn them on at night? <laughs> Good night, ladies. Good night, Bridget. Good night, Bridget. Thanks for being here. The king is still need full time help. Nifty, so I, I was just gonna say, um, night. Have a wonderful night. I love having the trees. <laughs> um, they're new, they're young, and so they it's haven't produced yet. But my peach tree it. has peaches on it this year for the first time. She, Georgia Peach Nut, said fourteen to sixteen hours. Buy you sugar. Them seeds I dropped was the melon seeds. Uh, I got some um yellow, orange, and crimson gray, Charleston gray, and a, a Korean melon. I picked up some seeds from the um, Soil Family Expo. There was a bunch of seeds. And you know what's funny? I walked past the seed table and said, yeah. I don't need no seeds. And then I went back to the seed table because well, you remember time. Leah from um, the Hoodstead? You remember Leah the Hoodstead, Mona? Huh? You remember the Hoodstead, Leah? Yeah, she was there, her and her mom. I saw Yeah. Her. She was standing at the seed table. She was at the uh -huh. seed table putting seeds out. And I had walked by and I said, well, I don't need no seeds. And then later I got was over there talking to her and I got to looking at them seeds. I couldn't help myself. I probably, I got a bunch of seeds, but y'all want to see some of the um, new ones I got? Look. Oh, look at that. I was, I have been looking for that one. I had somebody sent me some last year. I forgot who it was. What Thank is you. that? The leisure pepper. I did. Thank you for sending it to me. And I planted it, and I grew, and I got one off of it, and then the plant died. Aww. I saved the seeds. You know okay. I did. But I said, okay. I'm going to pick up some more of those. Okay. I got some, a different one. You see it? That's what I can't find, my amaranth. This is a different one. I sent you one. Did you get the seeds I sent you? No. Yes, you did. Last week in a card. Oh. Yeah. With the name like what? Yes, no. Did you? She said no. I don't know because I have I have a whole bunch of stuff sitting here. I'm waiting for tomorrow when I get the rest of my stuff in and I'm gonna do a, a happy meal. A happy meal. So I got these this emerald. This is a different one than the one I, I sent you. I sent you a different one. You sent me some stuff? Yeah. You oh, should have you got it. It should have, you should have got it. I said it last week. I got a, now I don't even like these. Radish? Yeah. But it's purple. Ooh. Purple. <laughs> it's purple. <laughs> and then look, this is squash. Oh, wow. Isn't it pretty? Mm. I don't know. It's, it's pretty. Okay, it's pretty. What's the name of it? I ran. Squash. And this. 
This is a hot pepper. Isn't that pretty? Nope. You don't think it's pretty? I don't like hot peppers either, but my husband does. I think it's a pretty plant. I love all those colors. It's called... I don't know what it's called. Hey, hands in the dirt. And then this tomato. Look at that tomato. All right. The pictures got me. The pictures got me. Look at that. Do you see that one? Uh huh. The pictures got me. That one's real pretty. And I got the black, the black strawberry tomato. Ooh, I want some of those. I'll send you some. Yeah, please. Mm. But those are the, the um ones that are, that are all those were all new to me, except for the leisure. Make um, that fourteen and, hours. What's fourteen hours? And I got this one too. Ooh, what's that? It's a sunflower. sunflower. Yeah, I like sunflowers. Okay. Yeah, the Mexican yeah. sunflower. I like sunflowers. Although some people say sunflowers. What does it say about sunflowers? Are starting. Those are some pretty colors. I have the fish pepper. Um, Miss Linda sent me fish pepper seeds. Somebody else, Mike, I think you sent me some fish pepper seeds too. Um, flower. I'm, I'm dropping a video later on. Is I think the flower? Tumeric? Or is it is the edible green or what? Turmeric is a root. It's a rhizome. No, like I ginger. said amaranth. Oh, amaranth. Amaranth is a grain. It's a, it's a grain, grain like um like wheat or corn. Uh -huh. Um it's a grain and um you can use the seeds like popcorn or um it, and it does have a flower. It does have a flower on it. Did you get my package? Not yet. I got to wait till Monday to see if I got your package. Um Fish peppers. Um, oh, it's a it's a um pepper that was it's a it's a variegated pepper, green and white, variegated pepper. The plant is variegated and the pepper is variegated. It goes from um medium to hot, or well, really a mild to hot, and it was used historically, it was used in a fish in a fish dish. To Bonnie want to know dish. what is uh, a fish pepper. Fish yeah, pepper. but it's just a it's just a variety of pepper. It's got some historical. It's got a little history behind it. So um, Google it because the story is kind of interesting. They thought the pepper was lost. Uh, it turns out some seeds were in somebody's attic. Somebody inherited it. Da 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 da. da. They grew them out, and now we have fish peppers again. Um, Darth X, do you eat it or is it for show, for flower garden? Um, if you're talking about amaranth, amaranth is a beautiful flower, and yes, it's edible. Um, the I think it's the seeds. It's like you know, it's like you know, like wheat has the seeds on it, um, or the berry on it. You can take that and you can use it to make stuff with. Um, okay. You can. They say you can pop it like popcorn. It is a grain. <gasps> Look at you making a hat. Did you? Did I send you a picture of the hat I'm making? Nope. It's a bag of nope. day. I ain't hear from you until you told me you was on your way home. Oh no, you you did say hi. <laughs> hey, sleazy. Hey, sleazy. I'm making a hat. Lows and see if they have the 200 greenhouse on sale for $30. If they don't, sell them, go and toss them. If they don't, sell them, go and toss them. So while I was on the road trip, when I what I do, I, I craft on my road trip. Great in anything, I make powder. You make powder out of your emerald seeds? Okay. How do you use it when you after you powder it? Whatever. Um, Did I lose my? I might have lost the sock. I finished my socks. Oh. 
but I can't find the second one. <laughs> it's not in my bag. My bag is right here. My bag was over full, so it's somewhere between the car and here. Where is that dog on I'm growing emerald. I can't find my emerald. I've tried. And I, they supposed to be heat tolerant. And I sent you some. The 100 degree weather would not allow it. Oh, look at there. This is a bag of day hat. I'll send you the pattern. You know they doing a, a, a whatchamacallit with bag of day hats. With, I mean, not her hats, but patterns. You know, because she won. She got that 100K or something. Yeah. They doing a, where you can win $100 or something. No, it might not be her. Somebody else. But they doing a, if you, like, take that hat and, and saying that you did her and you send them a picture of it and you're supposed to be in a the giveaway. They doing a the giveaway. Okay. I'll put it in there. I, I, I'm not done yet. I still have to do the brim. It has a brim hey, on it. Like, hey, crochet. It have a, a brim on it like a bucket hat. Thank you, K and K. But um, I like it. I've made oh, one. You know, I made a red one that's similar to this. Not exactly the same, but similar to this. You. But um, hey, K and K. Thank you. Me too. I'm growing red garnet and lives. I think I don't know which one I got it bleeding. Which one? This is the one I sent you. I think. Well, I gotta make room because no, Alina's Alina's Rojo. I got this a lot the, of these. I need to um. This is the one I sent you, Mona. Oh, oh yeah, that's the one I sent you. Okay, Alina's Rojo, 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 Rojo. I need to take a a, a video. Did you tell Mona about your sealers? Felicia, you got some sealers. Oh. That's I remember diversity love. Hey, you say hey everybody, diversity love here. Hey, hey diversity love. I got a um, hey, gift one. from there, from too. somebody. Huh? I got a gift from somebody. Uh oh, yeah. I got. Look, I'm just saying. I got I had a yeah. good time about what all you got. I got I to get for somebody. Here. Look, let me just tell you right now, I could have came home with nothing. Cause no, I got I'm hugs. Cause I got hugs. You got hugs. Yes. You got a lot of hugs, huh? I bet you it was just a hug and fist going on. I got lots of hugs. It's just good to see my people. Yep. Guess I who else was there? I missed the hugs. Q, how you know? I saw him. <laughs> Freak me. That was the first picture I saw. Look, y'all. Classic vacuum sealers. Oh. And you know what? I don't know if I had mentioned that I was looking for one or that I wanted one or what. It's but why we get the things that we be wanting. Sometimes we don't even have to tell nobody we want it, but we end up getting it. I don't think I have really said anything about it, but I have been oh, wanting to try the sous vide method of cooking meat. Yeah. And you need to seal it to do that. And then you cook it for hours. Those um, are cool. I love my freezer stuff in them. I yes. Tomato plant so far. I'm not planning. This is going to come in really handy because. I eat a lot of meat. Y'all know I eat a lot of meat, but I would buy large oh, cuts. I'm so sorry, dear, that you got to wait so long. Portion them out, and this will come in really nice. This was a gift. This was a gift someone gave me. Someone who might be in the chat. I just asked them to bring. Whose initials might be GWH? <laughs> I know that's right. Diversity, diversity, love. Didn't you send me some seeds? Here's the um what name? the second sock. The other sock is darker than this one. I don't know where it is. Yeah. I don't know where it is. 
I got a vacuum sealer. Those are cool. I love my freezer stuff. In them. Yeah. Once you fill the bag, you have to put something in hot water. Felicia, did you buy that vacuum sealer? You put the whole bag in the hot water, yes. No, it was a gift. It was a gift. It was a gift, but you're going to use it to ship yarn? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm not using it to ship. But you know what? Look, uh, I'm like, well, I'm here's the deal. It. it depends. It depends on the yarn because um, Anita, Sunita got some yarn that had been vacuum sealed. And when she opened it, the ceiling had made it hug real bad. Mm. And it and she, it ended up in yarn bar. Now, I think it was, I don't think it was the vacuum sealing that did it. I think the Hank was not tied like it was supposed to be tied and twisted. And that's what did it. She said when I got the that deal, you said you wanted one and I remember. I did. Hey, Austin. Thanks, baby, for coming in. That's my son. Hey, Austin. <laughs> Must you feel bad in a bag if you have to put something in hot water, you put the whole bag in the hot water. Yeah, that's the sous vide method of cooking. And there's it's supposed to be a good method for cooking for certain things. I think it will. No, you ain't send me no bamboo. <laughs> no, it wasn't bamboo. Oh, I got to check my um cuttings. I have some cuttings in the okay, bag. I forgot. One of those. <laughs> Thanks for speaking to my baby. That's my son. <laughs> He's grown. He's a grown man. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, that's my baby. I know. I call him my baby. <laughs> I'm so excited for it, though. I'm really excited for it because I had, like I said, I have uses for it. I definitely have uses for it. Um, okay. Okay. Oh, she says she forgot what it is. She sent it directly from Amazon to your post office. You got to go to the post office to get it, Mona. I like who, soupy who, steak. What? You get to temp what and then you toss it. I know I send direct from Amazon. Don't worry about it. If you don't remember, don't worry about it. We're not going to discuss it on here, what you sent me, but I appreciate it. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. I just wanted to make sure it was you that sent it to me, but yeah, it was you. Yeah. It was you. Yeah. You say you send directly Amazon? Yep. Yeah, that was you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm excited for this this hat. This is a summer hat. I'm excited wow. for it. It's so cool. It's so cool. <laughs> Perfect every time. Okay, sous vide steaks. Okay, you get to temperature. Then you toss on the grill for one minute. Perfect every time. Okay. But yeah, I definitely um, was interested in a vacuum sealer. And I remember um, when Hudson got that deal, I was like, whoa, I wish. <laughs> uh -huh. And guess what? You wished and what happened? I, you never know. You never know. I appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Hudson is such a sweetheart. She is. She made cookies for us. They were so good. Yeah, I miss the cookies. And you know I ate one in because you love How was them. it? How was you should you you know what you should have did? I should have done it on video. But yeah, you so should have. You so but I shouldn't have ate them at all. I shouldn't have ate them at all because you know how I do. Yeah, you I you ain't supposed to eat stuff like that. In. Yeah, you should have did me in. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Bonnie's back to the bushes. Got to go finish these dishes, but I'm listening. Okay. Where's my, my, my I'm like, where's my so water? Long ago, she should be done with, oh, she ain't finished them dishes yet. She okay, took a break. In the bushes. Gotta she took a break. <laughs> I thought, no, nah, she need to go on and finish them dishes. She would have been done by now as long ago. She said she was going to go do the dishes. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was cool in Savannah. Yeah, it is. Years. Yeah, it is. That's exactly right. That's what family is for. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Mm -hmm. So that means, and I'm Gary. See you um next month. Go. Yeah. Guess else? Guess who else I saw? Oh, okay. Who? <laughs> Miss Nancy. Miss Nancy. Yep. Who's Miss Nancy? Nancy be the scratcher. Oh. I met her the, when I went the last time. And Mr. Um, DJ Ron. DJ Ron. Ron. Yeah. Yeah. He, he out there dancing again. Um, you know, we didn't. We didn't. I did not go to the what? dancing. I don't think that they. I don't know if they had a DJ this time. Yeah. They. Yeah. Somebody was playing. They was. They was. They had. There, they was, there was music there. out there. There was music out there. And there was people dancing but i didn't go to that part we we um decided to do a late dinner that night yeah, you did that do, evening uh, do it and so i don't know who all was out dancing i was not out dancing <laughs> okay but that was a long day yeah. um for us and so i was like yeah no i'm not gonna do that <laughs> yeah my cucumber sunflower came up in my starter trace okay Oh, nothing came up in my starter trays, but it's a little bit cool. It's been a little bit cool while I was gone. Um, so I'm hoping that they will come up in the next day or two. Um, but I'm going to get some more stuff started because, because you know, tomorrow is the eclipse. Right. And what that mean? <laughs> Any excuse to start some seeds. Oh. <laughs> you know, you're supposed to start seeds on the well, Tomorrow, when I get up and go to the mailbox, and I come back and do my uh, do my happy mail video, I'm all the seeds that I get, I'm gonna drop. They had a band Friday night, yeah. See, Friday night we didn't go, Hudson. Um, we did the I talk too much. <laughs> we you went to dinner Friday night, and I never did make it quite where the band was. <laughs> interesting stuff. Okay, Bonnie, we we gonna tsh, be quiet, Felicia, because Bonnie feels like she gonna miss something, so so she can go do her dishes. We are gonna be quiet. Okay, nah, go do them dishes. <laughs> okay, Bonnie's doing dishes, y'all. Don't talk interest about interest. Hey stuff. Trish. <sighs> hey Trish, how are you? Oh 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 uh oh. Guess what? Uh -oh. What? Um, you need to um get in touch with the Hoodstead and tell her that we need her and her mom to come to the Alaska cruise. Her mom wants to go. Oh, she do. Leah don't really like cruising. She's Aww. like, she's like, y'all gonna make me go. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm like, I I sicked Ann Dale on her. You know, oh my god! Oh my god! Yo, Andy, I'm gonna go. We need you. We need you to go. We need you. Oh, oh my god! We need. What you mean? You need me to go. Yep. Speaking of which, um, who is it? Y'all need to check out these people. I need. To, I need to make a list of people that y'all need to check out. Um, Janet the Cruiser is that her name? Yeah, she was there. Yeah, she was there the last time. That's and her, her um, last time. And her um, blue hair husband. He got blue hair. How's your mouth? Blue hair. Okay, okay. And it's funny because we saw him at the Children's Museum. We were walking yeah. and he walked by and I was like, oh, I'm lo loving the blue hair. And he started talking to us and we were talking to him about the blue hair. And then I saw him at dinner and I was like, I didn't know you were with the Soil Family Expo. Is he didn't know that we were either? Um, and, but yeah, so I don't know. Remember maybe each other from last year? Maybe I don't think I don't think I saw him last year. They sat at the table across from us. He didn't have blue hair last year. No. Okay, that part. So, <laughs> but she was there. I remember her from last year, but I didn't remember him from last year. Isn't that funny? Yeah. Uh, but yeah. 
And somebody else was there too. There's a bunch of people there. I'm I'm not, and I shouldn't talk about it because I know people wish they were there, but I wish y'all was there too. My question is, my question is. Yes. Why didn't you go live any time that you was there? I'm just trying to figure out what the deal was, why everybody wasn't going live. I didn't see no live. Butler Family Farm was live the whole day on Saturday. Okay, they were there. I, I didn't see that. I didn't see it. He was live all now that I know, day. I will go Saturday. back and look at it. Um, who else went live? Somebody else was live. Didn't um, did nobody lives come up? No fit. I, I just feel live just today. First, I didn't I go live, and let me tell you up. why I didn't go live. Have you ever seen me go live on my phone? <laughs> I know I was joining the late, but Fr Humphrey, how was your? Was the expo? The expo was, was beautiful. Nice. It I was really it, beautiful. This here was colored too. Okay, but it wasn't. But the blue last year. Is you mad? Something? No, I'm not. I'm not mad. I'm just, you know. Yeah, Miss T went live. We were there. Yeah. Enjoying ourselves. Okay, y'all was enjoying yourself, but when I was there last year, I made sure the ones that didn't come saw how much fun we was having. Miss T went live a couple of times. Um, there were a couple of people went live because a couple of people got in my face with cameras and said, And who do we have here? And who do we have here? Uh, introduce yourself. Who do we have here? I don't I remember who they were. You was trying to cover up your face. But, you had a hoodie on and everything. But I, that was today. But Mona, it was cold today. That's why we had hood on. I had it a hood on. Oh, I'm glad I didn't go. <laughs> it was cold. But Mona, cold. my question is Have you ever known me to go live on my phone? It doesn't matter if I known you going live. I don't know how. I should have figured it out, but it was like I barely took a video. I'm not a good YouTuber. I'm just telling y'all. I'm not a good YouTuber. I barely took any okay, videos. Girl, well, People were taking pictures, had cameras Ms. in my Shirley faces like the whole Ms. time. Shirley, I, I didn't see Miss Shirley going live. Miss Shirley was there. She did. I saw Miss P live, but it wasn't what the live. The last time I saw her go live, they was getting ready to do karaoke. That was the last live I saw Miss T. Do. She, Miss Shirley, did breakfast this right, morning. Ms. P, not right. I ain't mad. I'm just passionate about. You know, I wanted to see. I'm trying to be lots of like I did too, Jane. Though I thought it was gonna be like it was last year. Every, Y'all couldn't, they couldn't watch nothing else because everybody was going live. Because everybody live. was going live. That is true. That is true. Uh, everybody had a camera. Everybody had a camera up the you whole time. You can see all different angles. You can see the same thing, but different angles. Angles and stuff. It was like yeah. You didn't know which way to move to because everybody was live. It was that like, is true. There was tr That is true. I, I was busy. I was working. I don't know what you're talking about. I was working. I was tired i was tired to go live i barely made the expo oh cousin, well i hope you get some rest you got to go to work tomorrow it will you probably oh. don't because if you did you wouldn't be on here right now right right i tell you it was it was um Jane is eating bacon cheese sliders and cheese fries from like, oh, that sounds good. I, I haven't had like a long time. You know what? I'm going to go home. I might. Like I, you said, I wanted to live through the lives. lives. I'm sorry, y'all. Um, I, I I have to do better next event. I but I, to I, I, honestly, I am not. Yeah, I want to live about, through the lives. I'm, I'm not good about doing it. I really am not. I got other things to do now. <laughs> no. <laughs> I wanted to see it live. Yeah. Look, I was looking for stuff last night. I'm trying to remember that movie that I saw not too long ago. Last I night. I'm trying to see what I did last night. 
Last night was the dinner. I didn't go. You know what? Did I take my? Did I even take my? I didn't even take my phone out at the dinner last night. I was tripping. I'm off tomorrow. Okay, I thought so. Yeah. Yummy. Yeah, I mean, I've got emo. See, you, I know about you, sugar. They just they ain't think about us, man. Look, that's not true. Yeah, yeah, they ain't think about that's us. That's not true. That's not true. Yeah, Everyone has a friend. Half hour is Mona. Half hour is Mona. Half hour is Mona. I was like, she couldn't make it. Half hour is Mona. Hey, oh, far, hey, where's Mona? Hey, Felicia, where's Mona? Where's Mona? Where's Mona? I, where's I, Mona? Where's I know Mona? you got tired of that one, didn't you? Where's Mona? Not really. Oh, okay. just, they, they, they were just showing love. People just showing love. Oh. So. oh. They knew I wasn't coming, so why would they ask you that? Because cause I wasn't supposed to be there. And people were saying to me, hey, I thought you weren't coming. Because I had, you know, I had said it was too no, much. They, they was hoping that I'd pop up too. So where's Mona? Okay. Where's Mona? Because I wasn't supposed to be there. And then when Southwest dropped them $49 flights, I was like, Mona probably trying to find a ticket. I was I, waiting. I was I waiting for you to see, say. I didn't see no $49 flights from here to there. There was some, I don't know where they were from, but you know how I Southwest do. I didn't have it. But I know because I'm pissed off because right now they got round trip tickets from here to my hometown the week that I'm leaving for $129. Yeah. So I'm like, yeah. you know what? But if I would have waited, they would have been doggone what? 500, 500 there, right. 500 back. Exactly. That's how they do you. Yeah, Riri wasn't coming you either, but she made it. Where did y'all go eat it? Last night was um what you call it? Um Lady and Sons. And it was good. It was a little bit different. They didn't have the baked chicken this year, but okay. um it was good. I actually I actually did pretty good on eating there. Um wait, $49 flights. I missed it. <laughs> exactly. Girl, I need me, I need me uh uh six bills said i saw them 49 dollar flights right over my head <laughs> <laughs> i need me a uh oh my video. god oh my god i I'm saw gonna... this video i'm gonna this is funny this is this is just a funny i saw this video today it was a little puppy and a little puppy says well now was... next year when I was in third grade, people treated me like a criminal. Oh, okay. Because I killed somebody. Uh oh, that's not like my costume. <laughs> it was so cute. I just said it to you. He said, like, "When I was in third grade, people treated me like a criminal." And then it was oh. a big dog. Because I killed somebody. I think I, I need stuff. to put those seeds up under the light now. I need to put mine place. someplace warm. Maybe I'll put it on top of my refrigerator tonight. It oh, was you, cool. You glad you're going to be a... Hey, we're going to go live. We're going to be live. I'm going to be all over the place live. I'm going to be so crunk. Let's go. Wait a minute. Let me just tell you. You're not going to be live and playing dominoes. I'm not going to play until the very end. Okay, because I'm just saying you're not going to be like I'm going to let everybody get their little practice and stuff in since everybody want to play me. They got to play each other first before they get to me. Cause hey, Subless. I'm the champ. How you doing, Subless? Thanks for coming in. Hey, I'm going to on next year to vacate someplace different. Okay, you should come on the cruise with us next year. Just saying. I'm going to pass next year to vacate somewhere different. You going to go on a cruise? You want to come on a cruise with us? You want to Alaska next year in August. August 2025. You got plenty of time to put in your vacation time and save up money. Girl, and deal going. Grow, grow, um, grow big is going. Grow big is going. Lazy days ahead is going. 
Who that's Lazy Days Ahead. Yeah. Jesse and Lisa, yeah. they going. Mona Good. going. Um, uh, best yet is best going. Yet is going. The hood stead of her mama hey, going. Living the, life is fun, living the fun life is going. It's like the hood stead of her mama going. <laughs> I'm going to try to talk them up. I'm going to talk them up. They not for sure going, but. <laughs> they, um, we've got. Um, there are, there's 50 cabins already committed. GT Junior. Yeah, we're going we gonna to see GT Junior. He got I'll the people somewhere. I wish we could see month. Let me see. I'm thinking, am I going to be able to do it next month? I'm hoping that if not next month, it'll be June that I'll be able to get my passport. Yeah. But I got to work on it before this year is out. I got to get my passport. My husband don't do I thought it was $300. This is like $160, right? What a party pooper. Oh, okay. My husband likes cruising. I think he just likes, I don't know. I think he your likes- husband have some fun on the cruise, especially if he like to, excuse me, if he like to eat, if he like, if he like to go to the casino, if he like entertainment. This this one's got the race, the car track on know, the top. You won't even know. What's it, is it know. bumper cars or what is it bumper cars on the top? I don't know if they got them on the Norwegian. I don't. This know one does. The, this the, the Norwegian Encore is the biggest. Yo, be on a bumper car. Oh, That's the largest man. ship in the Norwegian line, and yes, they have the bumper cars on the top. Well, we're gonna have a good time. We're gonna have a yes. I think they're planning a group event for the, just for the cars. Y'all, she was getting ready to say, y'all, we going to have a funky good time. She said, was getting ready to say Going to have a funky good time. Ooh. Hey! Going to have a funky good time. Yeah, come on, Diversity Love. Come and hang out with us. Come on and cruise good. with us. If anybody's interested in the cruise, I do have a live stream in my playlist, in one of my lives and playlists, Wait, there's one that's got the cruise on it. You can just search on it, Cruise Alaska 25, and it has all the information in there. Um, I'll put a link in the in the um, description box of, box of this one for the all the information. I'll put it in this one. It's not sold out yet, is it? No, it's not sold out. Okay. And there is a um is it August twenty fifth or August twenty fourth? I forget what the actual date. It's it's twenty twenty five. It's in August. Um, no, it's in August. It's not in April. No, it's um, in August. It's not April. It's in August. It's in August. I April have- is the expo, the family yeah. show fest. I think it's April's 25. the last day to pay. August 2025. The dates are August the 24th through the 31st. Ooh. Um, oh, have mercy. Oh, let me go make this run. Oh, what had happened? I was trying to do that. That's what I was trying to do. I'm drinking all this doggone water. So it's, the dates are August twenty fourth through twenty through thirty first. Jeez, if I can get it right, if I can get it right, first twenty twenty five. And so Norwegian. But don't call Norwegian if you want to go on a cruise. Do not call Norwegian. Um, I 
we have a there is an 800 number that you need to call um, for a particular agent who is handling the group cruise. So do not call NCL. I hope I spell his name right, but that's what I'm going to put in there. It's like, I cleaned out the refrigerator, but not the dish. Okay, cool. So, do not call the 800 number. I mean, do not call NCL. I'll only use the 800 number to Terry Spoto. Um, and I will post the, the uh, information in the description box of this video. When this video is over, If any, for anybody who's interested in going on a group cruise, um, to Alaska, it's gonna, it's a group cruise. There's not going to be a lot of group events, but it's, a, it's people, you two people in the homesteading and gardening community and others and friends who wanted to decided that we should go on a cruise together. And, um, and I will, like I said, I will post in the in the description box of this video, I will post the link. There's a video that Jesse and Lisa made about all of the details. It has the 800 number. It has a contact number. There's a you. There's a Facebook group, so you can join the group if you are a solo cruiser and you're looking for a potential roommate because you don't want to pay the full price. There are people looking for roommates, and so there's that option. Um, yeah, but a bunch of people that. You know, we know are going to be there. A bunch of people that I don't know are going to be there. Like I said, there's been at least 50 rooms booked already. Um, but it is not sold out. Yeah, best yet did go live. Um, best yet dropped a bunch. Of, she dropped a bunch of videos. I dropped a couple of shorts. I did not go live. I have never gone live on my phone, and I really don't know how to go live on my phone. I'm just not used to it. Yes. Yes. You will get to meet Jesse. I met Jesse last year. He's the best. I love Jesse and Lisa. They are the best. They stayed right here in my hometown. Yeah. I got to meet them last year. They came to Alabama for the um, Petals from the Past event. And that was so good. I got to meet them. Got to meet Belt Loop 29. Um, what? Gary. Yeah, he came. Um, that's where I met Butler Family Farm. They were here. Um, the Brown family um homesteaders, they came. It was it was a good meet. I got to meet um um what's his name? Bobby's sister. Bobby's little sister who um, she makes stuff. Yeah. I want to starve a week, then eat. Lisa's cooking for a week. I know that's right. <laughs> I know that's right. <laughs> but yeah, it was it was good. I forget um, all who was there at the thing. Lisa, did you know Mona before YouTube? No, Bonnie, um, I did not know Mona before YouTube. I met Mona at the Soil Family Expo last last April. April 2023 is where we met. Um, but I I think I first started following her from Humble Stewards. Really? Yeah. yeah. I think it's Humble Stewards channel, which is a channel that Best Jet Journey has with um, Tia and Gina, where they do crafting and things like that on the channel. And um, we, we were crocheting over there. And um, that's where I met Mona on hum Humble Stewards on the crafting channel. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's been nice. That's one of the things that I can say about the Soil Family Expo. Even though it's a gardening and homesteading um, meetup group, I mean, meetup for for YouTubers is YouTubers meetup. Um, 
the people there are just real. They're just real people. There's no drama. There's no, you know, there's no messy, nothing. They're just real people. And they're the same. Um, that's what I can, that I can say. They're the same. They're not, it's not like they're one way on YouTube and another way in person. You know, there, there's no stars in the show. There's no star status and nothing like that. It's just nice. It's just, it's like you find your vibe tribe. I think that's what I put. I think I, sh I did a little short video and, and you see everybody, they're just, they're just standing around and they're talking and they're talking and they're smiling and they're hugging and they're talking. Everybody's just back and forth. And the thing is, we're not that kind of people. Most of us don't want to be in a crowd, don't want to be, <laughs> don't want to go, don't want to leave our houses, want to be in our backyard, in our garden, or want to be in our craft room doing our crafting thing. And we manage to pack ourselves up and get to a place and hang out with people for three days. <laughs> so, yeah, I came from Chicago here to Branson. I don't know anybody. My friends are on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. And I mean, I do have a community. I've been in this community for, you know, almost 25 years now. So I know people here. I've worked here. Um, my kids went to school here. I went to church here. Um, I have, you know, so I do have a community here of people. Um, but um, the people that I hang out with most are you guys. The people I see the on the regular are you guys so yeah most of us are homebodies introverts some of us are are painfully shy not just shy painfully shy it took a lot <laughs> for some people to even go and then you get there and you have a good time and it's really good just meeting your tribe um and 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 you don't feel bad about um, when it's time to go, you, you like, you're sad because you know, you know, you're parting ways, but on the other, on the other side of it is like, you ready to get away. Cause you've been around people for three days and I'm not a people person, honestly, <laughs> I am not much of a people person. I, I, I do find in small doses. She said, I met Brampton, Al Georgia Suburban Homestead at the first meetup. I think she is Sunshine and her husband. Oh, Spoon. Spooning with Sunshine. Yeah, Spoon lives, and Spoon lives less than an hour from me. She's over in Columbus, Georgia. And I need to get up with her because I haven't seen her in a minute. Uh-huh. I did meet her last year at the meetup. So yeah. The cruise just isn't just for content creators either. That's right. It's not. The cruise is for anybody that wants to go. If you're interested in going on a cruise. Yeah. Hey, my cart runneth over. How are you? My cart runneth over. Hey. I was trying to think. Um, Lydia brought her daughter with her. Miss T with the T brought her daughter with her um oh there was a new channel um that was there um the beehive i think that's what their name is he's out of virginia y'all probably met him before it was new for me new to I me saw, i saw a couple of new people new to me was the beehive um Another, you know, he, he has bees. Um, and honey. Oh, I got honey. I got honey. That's good. I got to give I, me some more. I'm on I got out. honey. You know, I try to get local honey. I really do try to get local um, honey. But I also like to support my YouTube family. And so I got honey from J3GS. His honey is good. And I got honey from um, the Beehive. Their, their honey is good, too. He had little, he had little samples around, so he was sharing with people. And that was oh, that's good. good. Yeah. 
Well, you got some honey it. too? Huh? Duval says she got honey too. Yep, got honey. Where y'all get it from? I got some J3GS honey. Okay. And some from the Beehive. I didn't get any from um Bobby. They didn't have any to sell when I was there. They may have had some earlier though, because they were selling out. Things were selling out fast. And did they have some that freeze dry? Oh. Yes. Yes. I need to invest in me a free uh, freeze dryer. You go for it. I, I still say we should do one together. Okay. But you're going to be busy. If we do one together and, and it's at your house, I'm going to be sending you Ryan's money. Ryan's got to be at my house. I'm going to be sending you money <laughs> and sending stuff. I'm like, I got this shipment coming Ryan's to your gotta, house. Ryan's got to be at my home. Because. Because you retired. You got time. You do too. You got more time than me. Oh, I got more time than you. We got the same amount of time. No, we don't. Yeah, we do. It ain't for 24 hours in a day. I'm busy. I'm busy over here. I'm busy I'm over busy. here. How you not going to... How you going to say, I'm busy over here? You take naps. I don't. And... So that means you you got more time. No, it doesn't. I got the same amount of time you got. You cook 20, more. Ain't got but twenty four hours in a day. You cook more than I do. I cook every day. That means I, I got less. That means I got less time. And my power not on all day. I I don't turn my power on. Okay, so we not getting a freeze dryer. Okay, I hear you. I hear you. I need to get the handle put on my re rebounder so I can do my rebound workout. I'm not going to film it though. I'm telling you right now. Any, If you want to get something, if you want to make something take three times as long as it should, put a camera on it. <laughs> there she is. Hey, Mrs. Indiana Jackson. Hey, Miss Indiana. She said we just pulled up home. Nice seeing you. Okay. Yeah. To fall in the bed. I'm, I'm in glad bed. you guys right. made it safely got home. Rich. I get I understand. To to work tomorrow. Don't even get out the bed. Get yourself some rest. Get yourself, get yourself, yeah, settle. Settle in and get yourself some rest. I'm so glad you guys made it home safely. It was good seeing you and talking to you. Yeah. That was a long trip. <laughs> yeah. That was a long trip. Yeah, it was. I gotta figure out my um my trip to Texas. <laughs> Cause it's a long ways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm not trying to fly. So I'll I need to put my truck, go take my car and put it in the shop. Um just maintenance, regular maintenance on it. What are you eating? Apple. It's crispy too. I got yeah, one right got, here. It's honey crispy. And honey crisp. Mm hmm She said, thanks, Look, everybody. I was thinking about, oh, uh, they was telling me I need to do that ASMR. Um, You can do it if you want to. It's snowing a little bit here in Toronto. Wow. It, and I said it was cold this week. It was chilly. It was in the 50s and 60s this, this week. Um, So it was chilly. But that means I got to wear my sweater that I made. <laughs> so that means when I go to Ohio in a couple of weeks, I need to put on some clothes. I can't yep. be wearing my shorts and t-shirts. Um, the freeze dryer at home. I'm just saying. 
you y'all get you know, at my house, my Renaissance grandma said we can keep it at your house. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying. <laughs> we gonna okay. argue about who the house gonna be at. All right. I, like, you don't want to I think we need. I, house. I no. think we need a community freeze dryer because otherwise I can't afford it. <laughs> we were looking on Facebook Marketplace this morning at breakfast for freeze freeze dryers. <sighs> and the other thing is, I don't know what all I would freeze dry. To be honest, some of the stuff that people are freeze drying is stuff that I'm never going to eat. But um, she did have some free dried banana pudding. That's why I wouldn't know. She had free dried banana pudding. She had the the candies, the Skittles, and did you all, all them things? I ain't worried about the candies. I'm that that pudding, that banana pudding. Did you have some of that? I tried it. I did. And you didn't do no video. I didn't do no video. <laughs> why wow. you want me, why you want me to do a video of eating all the things that I shouldn't eat? It, because I could have lived through you while you was there. You knew it's, I wasn't gonna make actually, it. Actually, that is the only Freeze dry thing that I have ever eaten that I know of. I probably well, have eaten something else freeze dry. Excuse me. Just, just at least I have one. And just don't remember. I know. You don't need one. You just need to hook up with Jesse and Lisa. Yeah, because they don't live that far away from me. Exactly. You need to hook up with Jesse and Lisa. So I'll be right back. I need a snack now. Pop, uh, I know Mona's sitting over here eating in front of me, making me want to eat something. Yeah, sometimes. One virtuous woman. Hi, OVW. How you doing? How you doing, girl? It's good to see you. Where is that? I'm doing your hat. Just I'm going to bring it in here. Lydia dropping videos. Mike, I got a question. Did I miss the last video for the um the WIG? Um, I do have a video. I just didn't drop it. Was wasn't the deadline Friday, the fourth? Wasn't it the fourth? Let me know. I'm gonna drop it anyway, even if I miss it. I'm still gonna drop it. I'll be there. Look, look, look. I'm doing your head. Where's my sock? Oh, shit. This is the bag. And that's the front. Girl, look, look, look. Anyway. Do you know what this is? Ha, ha, ha. Do you know? Do you know? That's what I've been working on this weekend. But I didn't. Oh, no, I'll be right back. Blessings, feet, and morning. Air. Look, I had to stop. Yes, that's what it is. I had to stop because I didn't have the elastic. So I went to Joanne's yesterday. Thanks to OVW. I had to go. To Joanne's. And I bought that um elastic. And so. And what where I made a mistake was when I bought I bought black, right? But I should have I should have bought some white. 
So when I did the lighter colors, I would have had the white already because they had to sell. You buy three and you get two free. So yeah. Uh I was enjoying it <clears throat> yesterday. But I gotta take down take the two two um rolls down and then put the elastic around it and then put the other two back and then all i have to do is put the brim on there which you did the uh brim so fast i was like well i guess you got a brim tutorial because i don't know how to do no brims girl i'm just now doing hats so this is my first crochet. Yes, girl. Look, I'm I'm feeling a little like I got something going on right here. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm liking it. You know, I can't wait to put the elastic in there and put that brim on there and see how it's gonna do. I can't wait to see when I'm done either. It's very easy. Where is my sock? Excuse me. Mm, excuse me. Oops, excuse yeah. me. I did that like in a day. So yeah, that's real easy. I didn't think it, it took me a long time because I was following. But see, they kept showing, they didn't even, they wasn't even showing you. They kept showing that other lady when I did the um crochet uh I I typed typed in um Kango a crochet Kango and that other lady popped up and but the other lady shouted you out saying that's where she got hers from so when she said she got it from you boop I moved her aside pulled you I'm like I now I need to go through it and do all your hats <laughs> I didn't know you had the Tuesday tutorials. Well, you know that's getting ready to be on and popping in my life right now. I need to know, do you know how to crochet a name in the hat? In a bucket hat? Mosaic! Because I'm going to crochet my name in my hat. And I want to do some hats with sifting some soil in it. So when I go on this cruise, I have my own personal hat. Let me catch somebody with my hat on, with my name on it. <laughs> and I didn't give it to them. Anyway. But, uh. What in the world? What in the world? What? That tutorial? Okay, okay. I will be looking you up. Oh, she's got a tutorial on letters. Okay. Yep, and she says she do have the tutorial on the brim, too. Okay, okay. Definitely, I will be on it. But that's my next project. She has some nice hats. I told you I did the, um, the newsboy cap. Mm -hmm. for my son years ago before I even knew who she was. Right. I just picked it out on I think it was on Ravelry. That's where she keeps saying Ravelry but me and Ravelry have issues. That's just because you're not you're not that comfortable with it yet. Keep going over there and you'll be more comfortable with it. Ravelry is just a large database. That's all it is. It's a database. I not want to do a visor. There you go. You've been talking about doing a visor, too. I bought, all the, I, I bought five of them. 
Well, I bought, I paid for three, and what I did, I got the um the beading cord. Mm-hmm. And I got the round cord as well. So. Mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. Mike? You ain't coming over here eating no dog on pork skin. Why come I ain't? Did Mike answer me? Or he's gone? Because, because I'm trying to diet. They're on my diet. I'm eating apples. They, they're they on my diet. Just because they're not on your diet doesn't mean they're not on my diet. They're on my diet. Okay, I'm not going to eat no more skins in front of you. After it's the day. Y'all hear that crunch? Oh my God. And these are the. You um, didn't even have to tell me it was poor skin. I knew that, that crunch. The old fashioned ones, they're hard. That's the one with the. um. It's got the pack of the hot sauce in there. Oh, I'm putting on my. I use it, the plain ones. You know, I don't do sauce. No, do it come with the sauce inside? Uh uh-uh. uh. Okay. No, these are the. They're just plain and they only have the pork and salt. I have to read the labels. I have to get the ones that don't have nothing in them because some of them have sugar and maltodextrose and MSG and artificial flavor and i'm like dude <laughs> oh that's your signature I'm... okay well if you doing it i'm gonna do it so you know oh, ovw i have made chicken skin in the air fryer i'm just saying i thought skins was good for dieting it depends mm-hmm. on your diet I'm just trying to lose because my diet is low carb. Skins are fine for me because it does, they don't have any carbs in it. Um, but if your diet is not low carb, um, they may not be a good choice for you because they do have a significant amount of fat in it. But um, I'm all for animal fat as long as it's animal fat and not seed oils. I don't have a problem with it. I just need a good diet to follow so I can lose this weight. I'm getting ready to lose about 20 pounds in the next two months. That's what I need to do. Because I'm going on a cruise (laughs) in November. In two two weeks, you're going to be here. I'm going on a cruise. You're going to be here. In November, and I gotta lose weight before I go on my cruise. Where are you going? Bahamas. Yeah, you did. Actually, I don't care where I'm going. Uh, I'm getting on a boat. I'm getting on a boat and going for a boat ride. And you that be around about the time I go on a cruise anyway. We went last year at the what? October, November. Mm-hmm. And I think that's the best time to go on a cruise. Speaking of which, I might, might need to pay for that cruise. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> I might need to go ahead and pay for that cruise because probably coming up on time that it's due. I got the money. I've been putting the money in the bank. I put the money in the bank and let it draw interest. Until it's due. And then when it's due, I pay it. Mm. My water's hot. I'm boiling some water for some tea. I'll be right back. That's what I need to do. Put my money in the bank. Let's draw insurance until next year. And then pay for my uh, crew. Oh, 
Oh, y'all, I'm sorry. I still sure got into that dog on Apple. I had my eyes rolled all up in the back of my head. You know when I'm enjoying something, my eyes are closed and my eyes are rolled up in the back of the head in my head. Yeah, it's good. But I think this had it so pretty. Yeah. Oh, it's ready. We're like, yeah. I'll put that brim on there. I ain't realize it. This thing is ready. It's so ready. Okay, that's how you post a word. All right. Okay. And we'll see what's gonna happen though. That's what. I I'm going to finish it tomorrow. I'm not going to finish it tonight. I'll finish it tomorrow. Because now I got to go and find the video. Big Rooster! Oh, you like that hat, Jessica? Yeah. Thank you, Big Rooster. Yeah. I'm liking it, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm liking that. Yeah, I'm liking it too. Ha! I'm <laughs> liking it too. He says OVW's pad. I put that brim on this baby. Ha! Look. I'm excited for real now. He said that's OVW's pattern. Nice. Yeah. I like yes. that. Hey, hey, big rooster. I've been looking for you, big rooster. I don't see you going on TikTok no more. On the TikTok? My son wants me to go I've on TikTok. I've been over there having fun at TikTok. I went good. live last week. I was live on here and at TikTok. That was crazy because I didn't know what was going on. People <laughs> were sending me hearts and roses, and I didn't know what was going. Guess what? I made 71 cents that night. You need to do it again. You need to do that again. Duval says she made a hat with the brim to wear to the expo. She can't remember how she made the brim. I keep telling y'all the right stuff there. I'm sure listen to me. What do I know? <laughs> what do I know? He said I was on yesterday for three hours. I was on yesterday for three hours. What? Well, yesterday, I, I wasn't looking yesterday. I was busy. I was out in the streets yesterday. But yes, I was. So what are you guys planting for the um for the eclipse? <laughs> we have any e eclipse planting plans? Yeah. I'm dropping I'm, seeds tomorrow. I'm dropping seeds tomorrow. I got a whole thing of seeds right here. This 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 container right here. All of these seeds in here. This is what I'm starting with tomorrow. I don't even know what's in there. That's the that's my container. I take out a container. I go seeds I want to drop, <laughs> and I put them in the container. And as I drop them, then I move them back into the containers they belong in. So yeah, whatever's in there is what's being dropped tomorrow. Weather for Arnold, conditions are clear with temperatures of 52 degrees. The wind is blowing from north northeast at one miles per hour, and the current humidity is 55%. I got a question. Did you ever? I need to go to, and I, you know what? I'm probably going to go to, why do I got stuff from my shopping cart? I'm probably going to go to one of the stores tomorrow. Because I got to go out to pick up Bella anyway. Bella's at boarding still. I'm not going to pick her up until tomorrow. Did you hear me say I went to Joanne's yesterday? No, ma'am. OVW made me go to the um, Joanne's yesterday. She made you go? Yup. 
Okay. Yep. And the OB W for Orange. Like I said, they had these on sale. These Buy three, three and get and get two free. What is that? That's the elastic cord. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They was three ninety nine a piece for five yards. I ain't seen nothing on sale when I went to Joanne's last week. I had to go and get a thing because I was making um, toilet steamers, um, toilet bombs. I made some toilet bombs, and I had to go get a mold for it. And I ain't seen nothing on sale at Joanne's. I was like, okay. I'm planning a sip and sew garden party. I'm dropping seeds to sell starters and for my guests to plant in their pots, herbs, tomatoes, and peppers. That's a good idea. Ooh. Sip and sew. Oh, one of the ladies that I met. Did you see Jessica's? I need to do a seed. We do have a seed to drop. My Mr. wanted me to tell you about them, but I told him that chat was too busy. <laughs> Well, listen, to, listen to the uh, listen to the mister. I like that. Two ninety nine. Okay, they must have the sale must have just started. And I bought this. That's pretty. It's almost like a dinner. Whoa, whoa! Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah. Hold, on. hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Somebody I met this weekend who lives in near Atlanta does sewing with the sewing machine, not sewing with seeds. And she does sip and sews. And I think I might go to a sip and sew at her place, at her, sew, her sewing studio. I think it'll be fun. Maybe I'll do a, a weekend getaway to Atlanta. And while I'm there, do a sip and sew. That sounds good. You make me want to make some tea. This ain't even tea. This is cocoa. Um, I still want to make some tea. Um, I, I was going to gonna have some tea, you but I had, some, now. I had some cocoa. So I made that instead. But this is mushroom cocoa. I got to... If I like it, I ain't decided if I like it or not. If I like it, I'll tell you where I got it from and what it's called. I need to go back to the store. Why? Because I got a 50% off. Oh. Item. I need to go get some more. Yarn. <laughs> I need to find my receipt because I probably got a coupon too. Mm. Mm. That's the color yarn I crochet now. To make a blue and white long granny kerrigan that I was telling Felicia about. Oh, that's that's the color. Mm. From Baker's Creek Dragon Tongue Beans, Lemon Drop oh, okay. Watermelon, Bite Bite Alpha, Lemon Cook Cucumbers. Get stuffed tomatoes, marigolds, four flowers, plus herbs. Yeah, I need to get that out there too. My herbs is coming up, I think. I saw some um what was that? Yeah. I forgot what it was that was coming, coming up. I gotta so check on mine. <clears throat> Duval, that sounds beautiful. I gotta check on my um Mutriki mushroom cocoa. I hope it's good, Felicia. <laughs> so you hope it's good? It's um it's let me see, it's the super mushroom blend, superfood mushroom blend hot chocolate. Um and it's um it's sweetened with monk fruit and cocoa and coconut mm. sugar. Um that sounds so good. It has, I think it has only five grams of carbs. It's not sweet, sweet, but it's not, 
it's you can it's it's got enough in it that you don't have to add any sugar to it but if you like your sweet sweet you could add sugar or honey to it so you need to transition my lemon and lime tree back outdoors is it warm yeah. enough to put them outside jessica what are your night temperatures didn't you just drop your night temperature so I'm trying to think what else is in this, what is in here. It has lion's mane, lion's mane, reishi, chaga, turkey tail, and turkey tail in there. And what? Yes, turkey tail and... um. Lion's mane, reishi, chaga, and turkey tail are in this um hot chocolate mix. You got that from rice? No. What? Yeah. I'm not fooling with Rise because Rise has got their business model is bad. Uh oh. Rise be charging people. You be canceling on Rise and they be trying to charge you. Still trying charge to charge you anyway. I'm Rise. not doing no subscription with nobody. I picked this up local. Oh, I picked it up at the local health food store. Yeah. Talk to the people because I said something to them about that too. But Rise, I think, somebody, I think somebody else said that to them too. Mentioning that they didn't want the membership, they want to buy it when they want to buy it. I want to buy it when I want to buy it, and and if you're gonna give me a discount for a membership, um, then don't charge me when I cancel it. If I cancel it and you charge me after I canceled, I'm not I'm not doing business with somebody who does that. That's a poor business practice, and I'm not doing business with it. I like the Rise product. I enjoyed the Rise product. I really did, but I would rather. Pay more for it and pick it up at the store, a local store, than to order from somebody mm -hmm. who's got mm -hmm. shady business Very practices. Jessica, I'm on my way to your house. So that show would be so good. I right only there. have them out during the day in the shade at first. Yeah, that's a good idea. Transitioning them. I grabbed a yogurt too. Too lazy to cook. <laughs> I get it, Mike. I didn't cook when I came home today. I had some ham and some cheese, and I just made some ham and cheese roll-ups. Okay. <laughs> A ham and cheese and roll it up, <laughs> put it on the plate, and eat it. <laughs> but I'm doing my best to get back on track, and then I'm drinking this, which I probably shouldn't be drinking, but I'm drinking this. Yeah, somebody sent me some tea. I want to make some tea. But I'm going to wait until after I do my um, unboxing so I can have tea every night. Yeah. I need to get back on my teas at night. Chocolate is good and hot cocoa. Yeah. Do my apple cider vinegar. Dragon tongue beans. Oh, dragon tongue beans. Okay. Lemon drop watermelon. If you like it, I don't Alpha know. and lemon cucumber. Okay. Get stuffed tomato. That good stuffed tomato looks nice. I've seen it. It looks nice because it it just has the it almost looks like a bell pepper when you open it. Marigolds for flowers plus herbs. Nice. Very nice. Oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> Don't threaten me with no good time. Shoot. Girl. Broke water broke out. Broke out a cup that said that. Don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> ask somebody. Cause girl hit look. Girl move for food. You better uh -huh. ask somebody. Don't tell me. Give me your address. I'll be there. <laughs> a long burning carny. Yeah. Girl like to eat. I only have them out during the okay. I'm pulling my blueberry cake out of the oven. Ooh, I love blueberry everything. Mike, did I miss the deadline for the last um WIG video? I don't know if you heard yes. me before when I asked. Yes. It was it was the fourth? Fifth. The fifth? Yeah. Well, okay, fine. Be that way. I'm still gonna I'm still gonna drop the video even though I missed the deadline. Cause I want y'all to see my garden failure. It seems like every year on the WIG I have a failure. I mean I have successes. That's why I stopped doing, that's why I stopped doing the um 
challenges because my stuff, like my sh stuff in here is just growing like crazy. I dropped some seeds outside and they coming up. Look, I was like, you know what? I'm not doing no challenge. <laughs> I don't like I don't like doing the challenge. I like doing the, the WIG challenge. I like doing too much during the challenge. I like the WIG channel challenge because I think people should be growing inside. And I did drop videos all throughout the challenge. And there's a video in there with me with me harvesting. But um in the final analysis in the 2022 WIG, I planted some a tomato and a pepper. That is still alive from 2022. That's still that's producing. Mm -hmm. So from 2023, I still have a tomato and herb, two tomatoes and herb that's still producing. So it's not like it's a total failure, but my rosemary died. Mm Well, this time I put my herbs outside. I didn't start them inside. I didn't start them in no arrow garden. I, I built my planter and I put it outside. I got a three-tier planter. Yeah. And I put them out there. I got some oregano. I got some thyme. And I got some dill. I got some chives. And... Oh, I'm in the bracket. I'm in the bracket anyway. Okay, that's cool, Mike. But I do. I'm still gonna do a final video and upload it. Probably upload it tomorrow um, because I want people to see where I ended up at the end of the year. I missed the video for at home, but I'm still gonna post it. My tomatoes and peppers look very good. I ate some of my sweet 100 tomatoes. Okay, see, yeah, that part. Cause I did. I mean, I sh I harvested from those tomatoes already. I harvested, I had two harvests off of my um, mullein already. Um, and I have another harvest. I'm getting ready to, getting ready to harvest my mullein tomorrow because I'm a transplant. That mullein is going outside. Um, it's doing really good. It's going to go outside. Oh, wow. We had 70 people. Well, you know, bro, Big um, got a challenge going on. Is that a pepper challenge? Uh, he got a pepper and tomato and survival i mean uh, oh yeah the vineyard chicks, the vineyard chicks have a survival seed challenge yeah. all you have to do is email them and they'll send you the seed oh yep survival seed challenge and you, then you can plant them um biscuits sausage and gravy fried potatoes eggs onion eggs bacon for breakfast if you start driving by 3 a.m you'll be here by 6 a.m or so bonnie <laughs> <laughs> that's funny jessica <laughs> go ahead and start driving you'll be here you'll be here at time of breakfast if you start be driving guess. at 3 a.m we'll be here by six or so jessica Mama. says i love the sweet right off the vine i love the sweet 100 eat right off the vine sweet I started 100 some tomatoes I started some Whoa. sugar bomb tomatoes. Some tomatoes I bought at the grocery store that was so good. I just took the seeds out of them and planted them. He and got um, tomato zucchini. Yeah, you got a, a zucchini one going on too. And a, a radish. And yeah. A, yeah, you got a beet, a, a Detroit beet. I'm not growing those pepper, Detroit beets. A Peter Pepper. The Peter Pepper, a Peter Pepper, what he does tomato, every year. A zucchini and a radish. Couple of others, yeah. I think. Yeah, yeah. The Peter Pepper. I'm like, you know, know. That's, a, that's a bit much. I can't do that either. Uh, I don't mind. You know, I don't mind you the challenge. Like I said, water. I like the, the winter indoor growing challenge because a lot of people don't think they can grow at all, and they definitely don't think they can grow during the winter time. And it's like, but you can, and you can have good food in the winter time. And so I did um, tomatoes and herbs and peppers, but I've done other stuff. I went to this health food store while I was in Savannah. It's called Brighter Days. And I went to the restroom and in the restroom, they had a poster. I might show it of squash, all different kinds of squash. Mm. 
I thought it was so cool looking. I was like, I took a, so I took a picture of it. <laughs> mm. I don't know who the um, it's like those posters that you see. Um, I got so much stuff. It's like those posters that you see. You know, you've seen the butterflies and the different plants and stuff. It's like that, but a squash. Mm. Here, here it is. I don't know if you can see it. You know what? Yeah. We done went overtime. See? So you got your nap. Yeah, that's cute. It's all kinds of squash. I was like, I like that. I'm going to take a picture of that. <laughs> I'm going to do the tomato and pepper one. Okay. I'm not entering any more challenges. I am growing the Paul Robeson because GT Jr. wants everybody to grow it. That's the one that um, G Hud wanted us to grow last year. And I did right. start it. And the one I'm growing is last year's. It's, I started it last year. It's still alive. I got cuttings off of it. I'm going to um, probably be potting those up. I don't have any more seeds. I don't have any. I, I might have one or two seeds, but I, like I said, I've got cuttings off of the plant. And so I'm going to pot up a couple of those tomorrow. Um, and then transition them into outside and um, because they're it's in, I have one in the arrow garden and I've got a couple in water right now um, cuttings off of it so yeah so would you add a little butter to your warm blueberry cake absolutely mm -hmm. why wouldn't you that makes it butter yes, makes indeed. Why not? it's warm Butter makes everything better. That's all you doing. She know I want some. Do you ever make blueberry dumplings? Uh -uh. I love blueberry dumplings. It's like one of my favorite ways to eat blueberries. But if you don't love blueberries, you won't like blueberry dumplings. Mm. Okay. Cause there's it's a it's lot of what I got. It's a lot of blueberry and a little blue and a little bread versus a lot of bread and a little blueberry. <laughs> it's like an inside out blueberry muffin. <laughs> Duval says you have to put butter. What? Blueberry dumplings? I will be making some this week. Sounds like, yep. Yeah. Blueberry dumplings. I love blueberry dumplings. And you can cheat. You can cheat. I have cheated with, um, um, using the, the, um, the frozen biscuits, like the Mary B's or the Marshall's take it out, let it thaw out and cut it into quarters and then drop it into the blueberries. Once the, um, once the blueberries are cooking and it gets really good and hot, drop them in instead of making, um, biscuit dough. If you don't want to make homemade biscuits, I make homemade biscuits cause it's easy. I have a good recipe. It's easy. Um, and if you like other kinds of dumplings, you can use any other kind of dumpling that you like to to use. Um, but I like the biscuit dough. You could even use canned biscuits if you like those. I prefer the frozen ones. Mary B's are good, um, and Marshalls are good. I don't know if you have those brands where you are. Mary B's is a sponsor, official sponsor of the Montgomery Biscuits. That's our um, minor league baseball team, the Montgomery Biscuits. All right, that's looking good, Mona. You gonna make a bucket? Nope. Beanie? Yeah, yeah, bucket, bucket. Yeah, if not homemade, I don't mind the frozen. One. Yeah, I don't. The frozen ones are pretty good. Yeah, I don't know. I, they are biscuits are carbs. I don't eat them anymore. I don't do it anymore because you know new way of eating, but it doesn't mean I don't love it. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm all about the love. <laughs> and because and it's funny because I don't do the carb dishes. I still do the fruit, even though the fruit is carb. Um, I love blueberries. I love fresh blueberries. So I can eat just the blueberries but i do like blueberry dishes i love a good blueberry pie i like blueberry muffins i like you know blueberry bread lemon lemon and blueberry together go good together mm. that hat fits great and looks like it's comfortable yeah
She gonna make me put this hat on. <laughs> oh, I'm getting ready to put the brim on this hat, but I'm not gonna do it now. She says I can eat anything blueberry. Yep, it's ready for the brim. I like it. I like it. It's a perfect, perfect hat. You gonna put a brim on there? Yeah, like a um, like a bucket, but it's more. It's gonna be a little bit wavy. It's it's kind of a sun. It's a sun hat. It's a summer hat. Yeah, it's a sun hat. But yeah, ready for the brim. I'll send you. I'll send you a link to the Isn't pattern. Fantastic! I like it. I'll send you a link to the pattern. Yeah, okay. I like it. Um, I'm not trying to be keto. Um, Chris, my diet is really not. It is a keto diet. You will be keto if you are on the diet, but my diet is more of an elimination diet. So right now, and I'm, and for the foreseeable future, except for on those instances where I make exceptions, I don't eat grains. So I don't eat any. Um, I don't eat any bread. I don't eat any bread. I don't make any biscuits or anything like that. Um, I don't eat grains. Um, I don't eat seed or seed oils. Um, I will eat seeds before I'll do seed oils just because in order to have seed oils, you have to have a whole lot of seeds. And so you get a minuscule amount if you're eating seeds. But um, seed oils is is an excess. It's something that you would not normally have uh, under normal circumstances. So I don't eat seed oils, but I have no grains and no seed oils and i try to uh, minimize the amount of sugar um refined sugar na and natural sugar in my diet um except for fruit that's Thanks in you season know. i do eat in season fruits in moderation it's good to well know. i try to i say try to try to moderate i try to moderate my husband bought red grapes now didn't i tell y'all red grapes are the devil yep you did because <laughs> i went and bought some and i was sick after eating them grapes, but I show ate all of them. Didn't I tell you the red grapes are the are the, you devil, said, are the devil? You said they was the devil. She said he said you had Jojo, ho ho Jojo. What is Jojo? <coughs> Saturday, still swollen. Yeah, my um ankles uh, are swollen from the trip. Um, and it's because I didn't eat clean. I did. I did my best with what I had. Um, but eating out at restaurants, you don't know what you're getting. And what keeps the goo close down? Me? For me, no carbs. No or low carb low carbs keeps my mine glucose down. Is, mine is keep my glucose stable and inflammation down. Yep. That's the carbs. Eliminating oh, the carbs, God. minimizing the carbs keeps my glucose down and my inflammation down. When I go off track and I eat stuff that I know I'm not supposed to have, yeah. um, like the swelling is back. My my ankles are swollen today. And you, you know, know what? I, my feet is starting to swell up. And I'm like, what? A, what's going on? Okay. So I, I put on my ankle bracelet today because I wanted to know. Um, what was I going got mine on? on. You was mean, going I got on. mine on too. Yep, the one I got in Jamaica. I put that one on. I was gonna look up something. Great babe. Oh, fried potato wedge. Fried potato. I had some fried potatoes today too. I yeah. even looked at my feet to see if my I'm swollen though. I had some. What I had today. Grilled chicken, healthy, but ruined it with fried potato. I'm doing good yeah. today. I had spaghetti today, but uh oh, I did good. We ate at Metro Diner this morning. We actually mm. went to. The, I actually went to the breakfast, and no, ma'am, I did not get the chicken and waffles. They look so good, but I didn't no. get it. 
You know what I what I had last year? What'd you get? I, and I was sick too, and I couldn't eat. I didn't have an appetite, but I ate that doggone um uh 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 something guacamole toast. Oh oh oh! It was so good. I ate half of it. And Cheryl was like, man, it must be good because that's the most she ate the whole time she's been here. Mm-hmm. Look. You know what? I ate breakfast. I had breakfast. I had, they have a protein breakfast, which was four eggs, bacon, and sausage, which was a perfect meal for me. Wow. Um, and that's I asked myself, lot. four eggs? Four eggs. Ooh. Bacon and sausage. It was a protein breakfast, um, but no grits, no toast, no hash browns, nothing like that with it. You don't need nothing else. Well, that's what I'm saying. If I had gotten a regular breakfast, it would have been two eggs with grits and toast, and so no grits, no toast, four eggs, bacon and sausage. Um, but I asked him. I said, "What do you cook your eggs in?" Um, she's like, "We use butter." I was like. Are you sure you don't use vegetable oil? She says, no, ma'am, we use butter. Avocado toast. That's it. I was like, I'm in heaven. Mm-hmm. Um, and guess what? I ate my breakfast. And we you know, sat around and talked and whatever. My stomach didn't go nothing. Mm-hmm. My stomach, usually after I eat at a restaurant, my stomach's like, what did you eat? Why did you eat that? Mm-hmm. You know we don't like that. My stomach was like, chill. I was like, my stomach can stop bothering me. Ain't that nothing going on. But sometimes you eat at a restaurant and it's like, I don't know why I spent money on that food. Now, Friday, now Saturday night when we ate at um, um, Lady and Sons, I had the worst indigestion I've had in a year. So I know they use seed oils. Yeah, probably healthy. It, it, they probably use clarified butter, um, or ghee, um, Chris. Four eggs is only like two hundred and eighty calories. It's not that bad. People don't realize that eggs <laughs> eggs are really not that bad. Oh, she said you. they had shrimp mm-hmm. and grits. Ooh. Mm. I was good. I was like, I would have been happy if we had eaten dinner here. Because uh, <laughs> <I said, laughs> that food is good. That food is good. After eating at Ladies and Sun, I had indigestion so bad. I sat up half the night because it's like, I can't lay down. I can't mm-hmm. lay down on this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's the same place we ate last year, right? Yep. It was okay, but it wasn't great. Oh, but no. but Metro Donner was good. The last time. Metro Donner was good. Yeah, it was good. Like I said, Cheryl said that was the most I ate the whole time I was there. Yeah. So, and I didn't eat a whole lot of ladies and son either. Yeah. Well, I didn't really eat. I ate the meat. It's so funny because you know they bring it out and it's it's um family style, so you pass the plate. I've never had kimchi. You pass the plate, you pass the plate, and everything will come by and they pass even the yams. The yams look good. I got less than a spoonful of the yams and I taste it, and I'm like, this tastes like it came out of a can. It did. <laughs> And I was like, I don't, I don't want no canned sweet potatoes. Not when I grow my own sweet potatoes and I know what a good sweet potato is. Like, I don't want no canned sweet potatoes. You know what? I was going to cook my potato, right? Mm-hmm. And I'm seeing that purple stuff coming out of it, right? I need to put this thing in some doggone soil. Kimchi is tasty. I've made kimchi once. I didn't make this the hot one. I made the sweet one that has the um, Asian pear in it. 
I am told kimchi is fermented cabbage. It is. It's a cabbage ferment, and it's not hard to make. Um, oh, yeah. Plant that thing. Plant that. You got enough. That's enough right there for your whole season. You don't need no more. And I got some more in there. Yeah. Kim that's from, that's I have from not the had the hot kimchi. I've only had the, sa the sweet one. Um, cause I didn't have the right spices to make the hot one. I'm going to try what it, it is, Cliff. That's what it is. Yeah. But I did like the sweet one. It was nice. It was, um, and I didn't ferment mine long. Um, it was really good though. Carve that puppy up and plant it. Yep. My carve it up. Why carve it up? Cut it into pieces. And so you can spread it out. Say goodnight. Have to be up at six. Okay, Duval. I'm not ready to just let it go too because uh Miss Felicia got her had her naps. She crunk, baby. She is look, and then I, she didn't no. drink that dog on Coco. Look. And now I'm fanning. <laughs> and now I'm fanning. Yeah. 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 Make me want to drink something hot. But it's hot. I've been I, I've been cold all weekend. I ain't gonna lie. I've been cold all Ooh, weekend. Real? It wasn't cold, cold, but it was cool. it's been there were lots of places that had air conditioning on, but they didn't need it because it's been it will get warm during the day. And like we were out. Um, you know, Saturday you're out at the Children's Museum, and in the sun it was nice and warm. But if you were in the shade, it was it was breezy. It was cool, and so you have you dress for both. You got a jacket on, but I had sandals on. You know, you know, you got on long, you got on jeans. I had on jeans and a jacket, but I had short sleeves, and so I take my jacket off. I put my jacket on. Take my jacket off, put my jacket on. And yes, this morning it was cool. I had my jacket on, I had my hood on, I had my hood off. I had my hood. And it's like, ugh, this weather, but it's it's normal spring. This normal springtime weather for us. It's not it's nice to be out. If you're out in the sun, it's really nice. Yeah, but it was very beautiful. breezy being on the river. It was very yeah. breezy. Yeah. Um, we went down to the beach, being on the beach, it was very breezy. Um, so it was cool. Okay. Um, so I have been cold, and then the place where we were staying, it was like a refrigerator. I'm like, turn the temperature up a couple more degrees. A couple more. Is there an extra blanket? I'm cold. I'm cold. I'm cold. I'm cold. I'm cold. <laughs> so yeah. So I wanted like this morning. I had hot tea at breakfast. I've been wanting something hot, and you know, I'm the ice water person. I always got ice water, and I did. I got a cup of ice to go every place we went, even though it was cold. I'm like, can I get a cup of ice to go? Because I like my ice water. Real kimchi. They coat each leaf with napa cat cabbage with anchovy paste, and they stick it in a jar and bury it. Who was oh, first oh. No, that, not just anchovy paste. Anchovy paste and hot pepper. You got to put that pepper in there, that red stuff. You got to coat each one with it. But before they do that, Mike, they salt it. And the salt pulls the moisture out of it. Um, And it wilts it. And then they pack it and season it. <laughs> And bury it for months until it ferments. <laughs> right? Who was the first per first person to do that? And how they know they could eat it when it was when they take it out? <laughs> yeah, fermented foods are fun. Are kind of scary when you think about who was the first person who fermented did those ferments. Um, even now, like I have fermented garlic in there, garlic and honey, ferment and 
every time I go in there and I open it up to get some, either the honey out or the garlic out, I'm like, ugh, this is iffy. <laughs> but I still eat it. <laughs> I still eat it. But fermentation has been around as a food preservation method for a very long time. Um, I have a whole book on it. I need to do more of it. So, Mona, you want to do how long, much longer you want to go? Five minutes? Three minutes? Yeah, something like that. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. She said, uh-huh, something like that. Two minutes? Mm-hmm. Two minute countdown, people. <laughs> fizzy garlic. It does get a little bit fizzy. Mm-hmm. Uh, the garlic is not super fizzy, but it does it does bubble up. When you do your fermented garlic, make sure when you put your lid on it, you don't do you don't seal it tight because it will ferment and bubble up. Um, what? You know what? I forgot all about that that honey garlic. You you take your garlic, you peel it, you put it in a jar about maybe a half to three quarters of the way up. You don't want it full because it will it will bubble out the half to three quarters of the way full. And then you cover that with honey. You put a lid on it, but you don't close it down tight because it is going to bubble up. And uh oh, it's going to bubble up. And um. <laughs> I think I said something about warning and there might be somebody in the basement. Oh, huh. and, and then once you, um, once it's fermented, you can eat the garlic cloves. I knew, I, look, I knew you was going to do that. And, gonna... or, or you can use the honey. I use my honey to marry. Have you used your honey at all, Mona? I forgot about it. I'm just remembering I Open got this. It. Open it. Is it fizzy? No. Oh, when I open it, it's going to fizz? Open it. See what happens. Look, it's so tight I can't. Pause. Pause. She said pause. Y'all trying to go to sleep. Hey, hey Georgia PG. Yeah. I don't have no strength right now. I might not be able to open it. Because I, I don't have, I'm, I'm okay. Sleeping. You shouldn't have closed it that tight because no, that, it, I don't have strength. Did you hear what I just said? Yes, ma'am. Oh, it said, psst. Did you right? Hear that? Because it ferments and it builds up gas in there, it's fizzy. Y'all heard that? Psst. Smell it. Hmm. Yeah, the garlic gets liquidy. Yes. It gets real runny, gets liquidy. Yeah. Yes. And, I mean, the honey does. The honey was yeah. thick when she yeah. put it in there, but it gets liquidy. And yeah. I yeah. use that to marinate my shrimp in. So when you get ready to make some shrimp. This weekend. Put a little bit of that honey on it and let it sit. Right. You don't have to let it sit for about, but for about 15 minutes, but you can leave it overnight. But you ain't got to let it go, but about 15 minutes. Pour the marinade and the shrimp in the skillet with some butter and saute that down until that marinade reduces. Girl. Okay. Okay. Girl. Miss Peach Nut, what you doing? Y'all trying to go to sleep. <laughs> oh. Miss Peach Nut said we can't go to sleep. I mean, folks coming out the bushes now. Oh. GT. Who's Hype Knuckles? Hey, Hype Knuckles. Yeah, I've been watching for a long time. <laughs> Especially well, when you were showing the seeds and talking about don't eat chips on the, the pork skins on lime. Yeah, I am going to eat pork skins You want to live through online. her and the banana pudding. Yeah, I was having a good time. You wanted me to eat the she wanted me to go live and show show myself eating banana pudding, but she don't want me to eat pork skins. Listen One of those is bad for me. One of those is not bad for me. I'm just hey, saying. Hi, hey, hi, Tarot hi, Destroyer. Hi, I love many niggas in my life. Okay. Tarot Destroyer. I have 
love many Negroes in my life, but not so many as you have. Well, expand your, um, expand your life. Go ahead. Expand your horizons. Love some more. Okay. Because Negroes of, are fun to be around. Yeah. Uh, high knuckles. Listening Just and working. Head in the bed. I'll have a lovely evening and see y'all tomorrow on the streets. All right, Jessica. We'll see you in the streets too, dear. See you, Jessica. Thank you so much for being here. Um, I found I got that that um fermented garlic from Bake a Leg and Dig It. I forget what her name is. You a uh, male? Me, right. Melody. That's, Melanie. That's where I got that from. And you can eat the garlic just right out the honey. You can just eat the cloves just like that. Or you can use it for cooking. I haven't eaten it oh, straight. It's raining. Out of, but it's supposed to be good for it's supposed to be good for colds and flu and immune support and all that stuff. I don't know that kind of thing. Would you say you finally got some rain, Mona? That's what it sounds like it's doing out there. It might be one of them June bugs popping the window. <laughs> I finally get to see a little bit of grass. Ooh, Ooh. no snow. No, it's we got plenty of snow, but there's right by the tree, there's no snow. So I try to put out some potatoes April the fifteenth every year, so okay that 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 opportunity will grant itself. So I'm pretty stoked about that. I'm gonna start some seeds tomorrow too. I was hearing y'all talk about what seeds y'all gonna start or whatever, whatever. Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna start yeah. some seeds so. tomorrow. You see them seeds I got, TT Junior? You know I was I I was in the chat like a mug. I was like, man, I'm, what I was doing? Some cowboy <clears throat> candy. Ooh, some Ooh. seeds. Who made cowboy candy? Chris said he wants some. Oh, I made some cowboy candy. And you know what I did? My for whatever reason, my cowboy candy came out super, super hot. Usually jalapenos are not that hot. And I took out the seeds from about half of them. I didn't leave the seeds in most of them. Um, but for me, it came out super, super hot. I can't eat it. So I put some dill pickle juice in there. Now I didn't think it was gonna make it less hot i just was wondering what the flavor would taste like not just just sweet it was actually good so if i ever make it again i might put some dill in it cowboy candy and pork rinds are good okay i think my deal is coming up too i'll text you to see who's the top 25 we can figure out i haven't finished working in my yard i need to go in and finish so i can be able to show y'all do a oh Show my yard. I got work to do out there. I got a lot of work. I got still got to get all that stuff off my dick. I got my I got a side bed over here that I need to do some work in. It's just got a lot of blackberry vines in it, and the blackberry vines take over. They are very yeah. invasive. They take over. Um, I, I got a mulberry tree. I will never plant a blackberry. Any place Why is that a bad oh, thing? Huh? Have you ever tried to walk through a blackberry thicket? Yeah, I forgot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but they're so like, good. they so, 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 so good. They also Ain't nothing good. like a blackberry straight off the tree. I mean, off the bush. Oh, my God. They also give me hives. Mm. If I get scratched what? by blackberry vines, I get hives. Mm, um, I, I eat the times. berries all day, but if I get scratched by the vines, I get hives. So, you gotta get scratched because you gotta go in there and go get them right. sometimes. And the yeah. <laughs> as a kid, I would Shoot. pick them, and then I'll come home, and then my mom would make this salve to put on my arms and my legs because I'd be all, I mean, whipped up bad from it. I'm just, I have, I get it's a, like a contact dermatitis I get from. The vine. So I have to wear gloves. I have to be careful when I'm cutting and trying to get that. And so I got to get that bed in, in shape. And I don't want to spray it, but I got to get rid of them blackberries. And blackberries are hard to kill. They are, they are very hard to kill. But it, the thing is, they have such, you can use them in so many ways. You can use the leaves um, to make teas and stuff with. Um, be careful with that. 
though, because the the raspberry and blackberry leaves will can cause some. They won't hurt you, but um, they can cause um, cramping. Um, and I won't want to say much more than that. <laughs> uh oh, we lost Mona. Where'd she go? She pushing buttons. But um, yeah, <laughs> it can cause some issues. So look it up and see some of the um, contraindications of blackberry tea, blackberry leaf, raspberry leaf tea. Yeah. Music so they Marty account. Hey, how you doing? It's going to be 68 there Wednesday. Okay, y'all are moving on up. I don't know what happened with Mona. Mona, you dropped down. Do you know what happened? Do you know? <laughs> Did you drop down? So. She might be in the background. Did I drink raspberry leaf tea? I mean, the raspberry tea? Because well, they sell it at Wally Work. Yeah. Raspberry tea is fine. If it's made with the berries. But if it's raspberry leaf, it's different. Mm. How did um, you know that about the leaf? I know stuff. <laughs> I read I up on stuff. <laughs> I read up on stuff. You know, one of the things I do is I'll look at the um, I'll look at the um, medicinal benefits of. I'll Google medicinal benefits of raspberry, or I'll look up um, um, properties of raspberry leaf tea. And so things like that. And you'll see, sometimes you'll get the, the warnings. Let me see if this is Mona. She said, it looks like her, her internet went out. She's going to have to come back in just to end this live stream. She don't know. She uh, she put it together, so she she has to end it, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You still gonna load that video that you was talking about? Yeah, but it's it's after the fact. I just wanted to do it anyway. I know. I I was listening. You was like, "Is it over?" And I was like, "Yeah." Yeah, I was listening. <laughs> sure. I, I, you I still want to see that video though. Say, yeah. Uh, you could have typed in and said, well, yeah, that part. I was busy. I was trying to build this ramp for the chickens, and then I'm building an enclosure for them to lay eggs. They yeah. like a dog. Mm -hmm. And, I, and I'm, I've and i been saying that, but they like a dog, so try to close yeah. them up. Something we were talking about chickens this week. I forgot what it was about chickens. Um, Blacks Tropical brought one of their chickens and um, a rabbit to the thing. Mm. Uh, Mona says it's buffering right now. It give I'll, we'll give her a few minutes to come back up, but she's gonna have to end the live stream. There's no way. There she is. Uh oh, there she go. Nowhere for you to us to end it if she doesn't end it. Um, but one of the things if this ever happens to you, if you're ever on Streamyard. And you have a live stream going and you have people co-streaming on. They're streaming it out to their channels too. The person who's hosting has to end it. And if they don't end it, it's gonna keep all running. the channels will just keep running. Whether there's anything happening or not, it's not. still running. In the <laughs> so you can turn oh, it off all you want. The camera won't be going or Trust anything. Me. But the live stream will still be going. A few of those. I've seen Everybody it go, and we still sitting up. It's still live. We still here. But one of the things you can do, like if your internet goes out, you're on your internet, goes out, you can go on your phone and go into StreamYard through your data connection, not through your Wi-Fi, but go through your data connection and go into StreamYard into the thing and end it. Oh, I because that's what that. Eddie Lugo had to do. Wow. <sighs> Because he had a bunch of cruisers on. It was like seven or eight people on. And his Wi-Fi, his power went out. 
Oh, okay. His power right. went out. Wow. And so okay. he was gone. But they were still there. And they're like, I don't know what we can do. What can we do? We're talking about it. It was just hang out. It was just me. So they were hanging out for a while. And he finally was able to come back in on his phone. Um, because, you know, through his data and not his Wi-Fi and, and do it. So that's what you can do. That's the, that's the fix to that. <laughs> but anyway, but we need to get off of here. Um, anyway, because I'm, I'm, I'm fading fast. <laughs> oh, you are? Yeah. Okay. Well, I was going to push the eight minutes. I mean, you know. We can push eight. Yeah, let's push it. Let's push it. We can- <laughs> The pussy man over what there. What you eating, GT Junior? Chips. I said what I said. He said I said what I said. He over there eating chips and pork <laughs> rinds. You, you said you didn't want to see us eating. He don't want to see us eating. Yeah, pork pork rinds are my um are my um a road food when I'm on the road and I want something to eat that you know how you don't really want some, anything substantial. You don't want to fill up on anything, but you want to, to to help keep you alert. You want something to munch on. Popcorn used to be one of my road foods. That's what pork, I ate last night. Pork rinds are Ooh, one of my road yeah. foods. Um, and my cuckoo stuff done use the salt that come that you could buy for it. Knowing I ain't need that stuff. Mm, I use real salt for everything. <laughs> With the iodine salt or the pink Himalayan? The, no, the um. Real, what's it called? Real Celtic salt. Celtic salt. Redmond. Redmond's real salt. Oh. Um, it's 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 mined here in the United States, but Celtic salt is good. I haven't tried that one yet. I have done. I do have used the pimp, pink Himalayan salt before. Um, but real salt has a different taste. I like it. It is not just salty, but it also has the minerals in it. That's the difference between the table salt, real salt, the Celtic salt, and the pink Himalayan salt. The real salt, the Celtic salt, and the pink Himalayan salt have the minerals in it, not just the sodium, but the other minerals and the trace minerals like the magnesium and um, the copper and the um, whatever. I can't think of potassium. They have oh, wow. all of the trace minerals in it. And the problem with salt is not that is is the problem with salt is is the balance. When you get your potassium and your sodium out of balance, then that's the problem. But if you get it in balance, then it about you know if you get it out of whack, then it'll throw your heart off, it'll throw your um, electrolytes off and everything. But the balance is there. Um, they're they're expensive. <laughs> the salts can some of the salts can be expensive, but you don't really have to moderate your salt intake as much. Um, I shouldn't say that, but yeah. Anyways, I'm not a doctor. I'm not giving advice. What I'm saying is that what happens is when your potassium balance gets off because you haven't you have too much sodium and you have too little potassium the balance gets off and it, it that can mess with your heart but if it's balanced then you um and then the those other salts they don't strip them out when they make that white table salt that all you get is the sodium mm. and not the other stuff too black bamboo salt is real expensive wow mm. I never heard. Of I never that. even heard of that. Never heard of that either. I need to go back and buy some of that white cord. I have a question for y'all, y'all smart people. Mm-mm. All the smart people in the house, yay, encore! Um, oh. If the body needs salt, why can't we drink seawater? It's too much salt. French sea salt, it's good. Yeah. There's a book. Concentrated? It's too concentrated. There's a book um, that we, um, it's a phrase. I think it's a book too. 
um, when you start learning about um, pesticides. I, I'm, I'm certified to apply pesticides. I know y'all garden people don't want to hear that. Um, but <laughs> I have certification to, to apply restricted use pesticides because of the job that I used to do. And one of the things that they teach you is um, the dose makes the poison. Plus the water carries it to the blood. Yeah. The dose makes the poison is one of the things they always tell you. Salt is essential nutrient is essential for your body. You have to have salt. Our bodies, all of our bodies have salt in it. But if you get too much salt, it'll kill you. Same with water. Water is essential. Too much water will kill you. It's the dose that makes it poison. It's the dose, dose that makes it toxic to you. It's not necessarily the item itself. Um, some things you have to have a little bit of iron. You have, you have to have a little bit of iron in your body. Your body makes iron. Mm -hmm. But if you have too much iron in your blood, that's a problem. Jane Doe say the salt content in seawater is much higher than what can be processed by the human body. <laughs> Jane Doe! Baby! See, you smart people. Okay. Find you see, out you all the smarts up in here. <laughs> Look, I'm learning so much from you guys. Y'all got me. Y'all... Yeah, I got a girl going. Yeah. So you think so, I should yeah. just go on and, and put this potato in the ground? In no, I think... No, I'm going to put it in the pot. Sweet potato? Yo, yeah. I think you should break those pieces off. Uh-uh. And put each of them in the ground in separate places. Oh, you think? I like what she's saying. I don't know how to grow sweet potatoes. I've never grown... Oh, that sounds cool. Break the pieces. Well, what what every I one normally of those, do is every I one of those pieces is a slip. You know, small shallow, shallow. The, them pieces. Pot, every one of them pieces is a slip. Off of it and put it in the, in the. But you know, like you said, that worked too. But every one of them pieces is a slip. Mm -hmm. What kind of sweet potato is it? Sweet, orange. <laughs> she said it's a sweet sweet potato. Orange. You can drink so much water you drown. You can drink so much water that you dilute your blood. If she drinks, oh, wow. it, give it yeah. time to heal over. Drink. Oh, if you break it into pieces, if you cut it, if you cut the potato into pieces, I'm saying break the slips off and then plant those. But if you cut the potato into pieces, let it sit out till the ends heal over, then plant it. Otherwise, it'll rot. Oh, I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. I'm. I'm not cutting up nothing. She I'm gonna put the whole thing in the ground, and when they start growing, she gonna move pieces of it. That's what I do. That's I how. I got time for that stench. Y'all over here talking about mm -mm, I did that the first the first year, baby. Yeah. What what happened? what happened? What happened? What happened? Baby, put, put dude, it, putting it, stuff in look, water. Don't put it in water. You take this and put it in water to get the brines. That's what a lot of people do with the potatoes. But that shit stank. Oh my god! <laughs> you have to. I, I have a very nose. water. You got to change that water every day. You got to change time water. To change water every day. I don't do that either. I would anyway, put like a potato no, like that. I will put the whole it's potato like, in the ground. I bury it about halfway. Ever. About halfway in the ground. When the slips start coming out, I break a slip off and I go put it someplace else. I break a slip off. I go put it someplace else. I break once I got about I twelve it. slips where I want it. I don't worry about it no more. And that's my potatoes. And that will grow about 10 pounds or more potatoes. More than enough to last me all year long. 10 pounds? 
10 to 20 pounds. It depends. It just grows a lot of potatoes. Nice. From about, usually from about six to eight slips, yeah, I can yeah, get poop. 10 to 12 worse pounds. Than poop. That stuff smell worse than my poop. Nice. I'm sorry, and I know. I <laughs> you said, I know, I know I Mona said, said it was no joke. That, that stuff, right? Man, you should have seen me going through the house trying to find out what is that smell. It got to get up out of here. Yeah. <laughs> I put it, I put it when outside. I found out it was that. Oh yeah, it got up out of here. I never did it again. Never ever. I, I had a video. I, what I was doing either. You know. I, yeah. I didn't know what I was doing on top of it. Yeah, change that water. No, I didn't change the water at first. I, I, I ain't do it no more. It's it's five eleven stinky. Ew, I don't use five eleven. It's worse than five eleven. But uh, it's time for us to go. All right. Hey, Sammy all right. I appreciate. Joe, good morning. How you doing? Hey, Sammy Here. Joe. Super look. pump water. Yeah, liquid stint is what hey, it is. Look, if you look, I ain't even gonna say that. If you want to be mean to somebody, get some of that. <laughs> pour it in the yard. Pour it at the front door. Say what? Pour it at the front door. Pour it at the front door if you want to be mean to somebody. That's funny. Mm. Yeah, that foul. That foul. That, ooh, that's foul. That's foul. Like, that's foul. <laughs> I want to say thank you all for coming, and I really enjoyed you all. I, I shouldn't be ending being mean to anybody, but uh, I because I'm good people, I'm not mean to nobody. I love each and every one of y'all, and you you all have a good night, blessed night, sweet dreams. Is it this one? Is this, huh? It takes patience to be in the garden. 